So, um, we left off yet last time, two days ago. Uh, we just unlocked the map chamber. So we did basically the first trial. We found the first um, seer. And now we got out into this area. It's like the, the dungeon is like the first trial. The, the map chamber is under the library. And this is how we got here. And uh, now we're here. Revelio. I I don't have Alomora right Alohomora yet, right? Hi Ariopa, welcome in. Bring. Hi Avi, welcome in. How are you? Guardian Liviosa. I don't have that spell yet. Ooh. Hey, my favorite goth. Where was the key for this? We need to we need to get these to unlock the Slytherin thing, right? Rebellion. So the question is, where is that key floating around? Hmm. Hey, God, thank you for giving us up to Avi. Avi, enjoy the emotes. Was it through a door? Huh. Do the Dedalian key quest with Slytherin. Um, I was thinking about it. I was, I'm just trying to find one of the keys at the moment. Um, oh, you have to, you have to go into your common room and then, or like you probably have to talk to a student and then they give you the quest, right? I assume that before that the keys are not floating around. Hey, Afwa, welcome in. I never know how to pronounce your name. I'm just, it looks very French in, in my, in my head. The special g garlic, I need to pro What? No, wait. I slipped into the, the line. The special Slytherin cloak is the next best of the Ravenclaw emo. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Wish. Acquire f and use a focus potion. Acquire maxima. Hmm. Acquire maxima and a durst potion and use them simultaneously. Okay, so I need to go to Hogsmeade, I think. Don't ban me. Set a waypoint. Did I? Oh yeah. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. In the end, you will be a genius. What do you mean? In the end, he already is a genius. <laughs> Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Okay, they have the exact same lines, huh? The girl and the boy. Ba -ba -ba -bum. Gonna do some stuff. Be back later. Okay, fake. Good luck. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. What can I do I'm for true. you today? So... Focus potion. Oh wait, Durus and Maxima I needed, right? Oh man, they're expensive as hell. Oh. 500 and 1000. Oh man, that's expensive as hell. Can I sell some stuff to you, sir? Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. Good. It's like... Buy, buy my clothes so I can buy potions. <laughs> oh, that's better than what I have. Oopsie poopins. Oh, this too. Okay. And I can actually wear it. What happened? Wee! Okay, wait, that is a... Uh... Yeah, this can go. Bye. Let me go out and actually look again at what I, I needed from him. Again. Farewell for now. Focus, Edurus, and Maxima. Wow, three potions. Focus, Edurus, and Maxima. Okay. What can I do for you today? I'm training him with riddles to be super smart. <laughs> Hi, Amando. I'm not uh, obsessed with Hogwarts. I'm obsessed with Witcher. <laughs> Bolero, hi. Thank you for the... 18 month resub. How are you doing? That's two that's two Twitch babies. Thank you so much. A wise decision. Thank you. I'm going to buy a focus potion. And I can't get the you 
Or did I already buy the Odorous Potion recipe? Hmm. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Hi, Cody. Welcome in. Mm. Hi, Heidenherz. Welcome. Hi, Cody. If Quali was in the Harry Potter universe, he would be Quali Vand or the magic barista bringing... Bringer of coffee in Borgir. <laughs> okay, let's hope I can actually brew some stuff in the... Um... In the potion lab. Potion, what's it called? <laughs> potion uh, classroom. I always forget where it is. Nope. Secret rooms, library annex, potion classroom. Did you just say the Witcher? Yes. I'm a massive Witcher fan. And I'm talking about the books and the games, not the show. Borgius and coffee? No, no, Borgius and quality. <laughs> Hi, Mord. Welcome in. How are ya? <clears throat> oh, I need to equip the, the thingies. The thingies! Wait, I had a new, new of this. And then new this as well, right? Yas, what the hell? These colors make... Uh, yep, this is it. Hi, gamer man, welcome in. Sell 10 dev stuff for the same price as 90 plus dev stuff. <laughs> ah, well, yeah, it's a, it's a magical world with very magical prices as well. <laughs> I can't even finish Witcher 3. Too many side quests is overwhelming. Me. Really? I mean, you don't have to do the side quest. You could just not that was do it. it. Is this the place? Everything. Yes, okay. I hope I can craft the things that I need to craft now. Focus potion, I think I bought. And now I need to try to make a Duras and Maxima potions. Ashwinder eggs. Oof, mongrel fur. I can make a Maxima Potion, that's good. Okay. Are you playing on Xbox or PC? I'm playing on PC. It's in the title as well. Mm. Who's your favorite wrestler? I don't watch wrestling. <laughs> I don't watch TV. Hi, I'm new. <laughs> Hi. Okay, let's pick that up. Can I make a few of these? Okay, that's good. I can always use a few Wigan Well potions. I like these little animations of ingredients popping into the cauldron. <clears throat> Are you a woman? No, I'm a lizard. Can't you see? Is it obvious? Ashwinder eggs and more growth fur. Could maybe go out of Hogwarts and try to just kill a few mongrels? Oh, that doesn't feel right. Is that a door? Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> just loads. <clears throat> what does the writing on your hoodie say, Liz? It says, um... Uh, there was no more room in Hogwarts, so now I'm living in a German city. Uh, alongside with muggles. Basically, it's like roughly translated right now. It was a gift a few years ago when I was still living in Germany. Hi, Bearded. Welcome in. Uh, thank you very much. Welcome in. Are you a full time streamer? Yeah. How do you define full time streamer? Uh, should I just buy the things? I think I'm gonna buy the things. Uh, Hogsmeade. Liz, are you gonna play The Last of Us Part 1? I've already streamed it three times on this channel. I don't know if I should do it a third time, actually. A uh, fourth time. 
Um, it's coming out soon, right? On the 28th. I think I'm still going to be busy with Resident Evil 4 then because I am definitely, definitely going to play the Resident Evil 4 remake. Resident Evil is one of my favorite game okay, series. Here I come. And Resident Evil 4 is one of the tops in that in that series for me. Uh, Resident Evil 1 is so cool. And then Resident Evil 4 is like oh, so nice as well. Um, so I'm really, really excited to watch, uh, to play oh, the, what the remake. What a surprise. You have a good head for business, haven't you? Flux sweet. Ah, oh, man. Okay, he's the wrong guy. I need to go to the other one, right? No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Somewhere up there. I don't even know if I've been there already. Why are you not playing Wulong? Uh... I don't know. What kind of game is that? I haven't checked it out. Hi, Juso. Hello. Is it this way? Up there, right? This hut? Eshka, thank you for giving us up to Michael. Hi, Michael. Welcome. Hello. How are you doing? Really excited for Silent Hill 2. A bit skeptic for Resident Evil 4, but that's also one of my favorite games. I think that the developers know that it's one of the most popular, if not the most popular one, um, in the Resident Evil series, and I cannot imagine that they would F that up. Watch yourself, though. I believe you're alive. I'm just gonna go to your chest and steal the 500 galleons that's stored inside. Don't mind me. Revelio. Okay, Mongrel Fur and Ashwinder Axe. I hope hello. she has that. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Deathcap. Oh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. I oh, will not touch your mandrakes. Constant Mandrix. demand for antidotes. I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. Okay. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Um, It's like Nio if you played that. No, I haven't. How long is Nio 3? Okay. I did the Mind Your Own Business quest for PlayStation 5 yesterday and it's totally freaked me out. Oh no! <clears throat> Hi Sam, welcome. But in China instead of Japan? Uh-huh, okay. I convey I have no idea, I never played. I never played Apex. What do you have for sale? Please. Well, what say we show you some of what's available? <sighs> no, she doesn't. God damn. How am I gonna get the things then? Is it is it exploring? Do I have to Doors go exploring? Always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Or do I just have to buy the potions? I cannot make them myself because I just there's just no Does way to get, get any ingredients. More cozy than Hogsmeade? Does anybody have a tip where to get like where I can buy Ashwinder eggs and mongrel fur in Hogsmeade or Hogwarts? Yeah, welcome in everybody, but please only English. It's uh, the first rule, and you clicked OK, so I assume you read it. <clears throat> Character is cute. He looks a bit, little bit like a, uh, like Geralt of Rivia. Pippins, just the potion guy. He's not selling the in ingredients, I think. Wait, let me mark it on my map. La -dum, la -dum, la -dum. Hi, Juzzy. Hello. Hi, Cringe. Oh. 
How about playing some Tarkov? Mm, you know. Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. Oh, he had. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. A wise decision. Thank you. I kind of want to buy all of these. Visibility potion. The thunder brew is really nice. A wise decision. Thank you. Come on, Yolo. Let's buy it all. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Okay, now I'm gonna fast travel to the potion class again to make these. Library annex, potion classroom. Is your character name a reference to something? It's a Greek swear word. Is the part where just uh, go into the office in the potions classroom and get them then? What? I don't think you can just walk in the class, in the potion class and just acquire the ingredients, can you? I think you have to buy it. Or do we, can we just loot the things here? Mongrel fur and ash winder eggs and stuff? Hmm. So... Hi, Ivan. Hello. Come on, Mongrel Fur and Jay Pippin's potions and harmonies. Thank you for looking it up, Coyote. Where do I claim my Dark Arts pack when I bought it? I, I, I got the Deluxe Early Access Edition and it was already there. I sadly don't know. Maybe somebody in chat knows. Fine use of focus potion. So we have Adurus, we have Maxima, and we have a focus potion. So I just need to acquire and use the focus potion now. Job done. Acquire Maxima and Adurus potion and use them simultaneously. Hmm. So I just take them both in their s in the same time, and I don't have to. Wow. Okay, that looked kind of cool. <laughs> he really is Geralt now, taking all the potions. Uh, Eudurus and Maxima, right? Excellent. Attend potion class during the day. Okay, okay. I shall go take... <laughs> just like a stone statue now. <laughs> Hi, Nimba. Welcome in. Thank you. <laughs> Did you see Imelda rise? She was like, and then oh, <laughs> the eye roll was real. Return to Professor Sharp. Okay. How are your assignments coming along? Very good. Very nice. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Your character looks like a Targaryen. I heard that off often. Wander. The Pulso. And Nimba, welcome to the stream. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, best not to go flinging your classmates about the hall. The Pulso. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spellcasting. Yes, quite indeed, sir. Accio! Repulsor! Still at it, Oof. Well, repetition can be an excellent teacher. True. Practice makes the master as a saying in German. That probably sounds weird in, in English. <laughs> um... And you should get it automatically check your inventory. Oh, thanks, mods. <laughs> you have the most original, most beautiful name ever, Liz. I freaking love it. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm playing an evil character and I figured it would make sense, you know? 
Let's see what quests I have. I wish there was a quick access to the... <gasps> Flying class! Yes! I wish there was a quick access to the quests as well. We have a quick access to the map, which I hardly ever use for some reason. I wish there was also one button to just go to the quests immediately without having to use... Maybe there is. Maybe I just never figured it out. There's something in there. J. Where's the J button? Tell me. <laughs> Where do I click the J button? <laughs> but thanks for the help, guys. I appreciate you. Wait. Revelio. Ch <laughs> chill, mate. Chill. Jesus Christ. He was angry. <laughs> I'm just going through Hogwarts and picking up those field guide pages because it uh, levels you up and I want all the abilities as quickly as possible and all the talents and all that stuff. Was it over here? Nope. Aha, here. Level up! Look at all of this. Oh yeah, this. It's just like... Ring, 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 ring. Just keeps on dinking. Dink. Somewhere in the D-pad. It's just this. But I mean literally going here immediately to this to this uh, window. Could I just wait? I want to try this. Oh, okay, I could I could just tap J on the keyboard then instead. Maybe I can remember. Hi Polly, welcome in. <gasps> Flying, let's go. Finally. I mean, I just played for I don't know 6 hours or so and now I can finally fly. Oh, amazing! This is the best part. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Yes! Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome to the lizards. Mr. Clotten, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that uh -oh. to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Hey. Not a fan, I take it? <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, Step up to your broom, say up, firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Oh, drops are not active anymore. There, there's no more drops. Drops have been turned off by the developers. You. Now, your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. Be nice to your broom. Up. Whoosh. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Yeah, let's go. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Okay, man. Good. Now. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Oh, I Do can't accelerate yet. <sighs> the brooms are I think school I'm getting the hang of this. I want them returned in one piece. Boring. Can it be a iguana or just a lizard? You can well be done. both. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Yes, let's. Let's, let's. Are we still allowed to ask how to get the Merlin cloak? No. This next set of rings <gasps> will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. 
What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a fly! Hi, Everett! Ha! <laughs> this is rather fun! Yeah, I bet. Oh man, this must be amazing. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Yeah, that must have been nice too. Where are you going? Whee! Whoa! Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. <gasps> oh, they oh, do they just appear or is it just ah? Oh, it's highlighted. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I wish it could Made go faster. Oh, did anyone else see that? <laughs> oh, well done! Have a moment? Uh oh. Hi, I'm Jane. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine Paste. you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class? <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Mm -hmm. Follow me. Okay. Hi, the tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Very nice. I love the flying. Ahead of the gardens. The out of the way! Out windows. of the way! Just peek oh. out! <laughs> Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? With the, Here's with the boost. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Wow! Now that's more like it. You Ooh. sure you're not part hippogriff? Mm, no, I'm not sure. Hi, Volanaris. Welcome in. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, uh, look at it. Yeah. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips cool. and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. Hmm. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Now we seem like we've it's taken us forever to go through the through the rings, right? Looks like we've already dismissed class. Better Hi, Mom. Hand in our Dismount here. Whoosh. And where have you two been? In the air? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Klopp, <laughs> I'm disappointed what? in you. You're in this class because you're, I... because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But, Professor... Enough. Class is finished for the day. Oopsie poopins. As for you... You do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Thanks. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. Why everything risen? Uh, I have no regrets. I wish we hadn't got in trouble. That's true. That, that does benefit me to get into trouble. Perhaps, but we did get in trouble and Kagawa could hold it against us. Rotten luck, that. I didn't think she'd see us. But it's no matter. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. 
hate having to return the school broom after class. Mm. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. <laughs> you can. You should. Oh. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Broom and subordination, this is how Voldemort got started. So... Damn it. So I know how to fly now, but I still don't have a broom. Damn it, I don't remember how I got the broom. Do I have to go to Hogsmeade and buy one? Oh! Oh, 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 oh! Go back. I've not forgotten about our library venture. Ooh. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, Meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Discreet. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery and thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Mm-hmm. Okay. The lamppost just wouldn't move, right? So rude. La 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 Hey Psy, thank you for the 20 month resub. Welcome back to the Chunkies. I hope you're doing good. Thank you so much. How many points do I have? One. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put points into dark arts once I get to the dark arts. Protego blocks will contribute to the ancient magic meter. What's this? Basic cost impacts reduce spell cooldown. Ah, that's good. I guess that's good to have. Um, let's check the quests. This is gonna be difficult to not do all the side quests. Usually, I always do the side quests. Meet with Professor Weasley in the shadow of the Undercroft. Meet Sebastian. Let's go to the room of requirement first. Still upset they didn't make Quidditch a part of the game. Maybe it will come in the future. I don't know. But many people are upset about it. And Mr. Claus, welcome in. Um, hi, Bandersnatch. Hi, Blade. Hello. So, wait. Um, how am I supposed to... Okay, this seems to be the closest one. Let's go there. Why'd you move to Switzerland? <sighs> I answered that question so often. <laughs> um, many reasons. I swear. Like, do you do you want to know why I picked why we picked Switzerland of all countries, or do why we moved away in the first place? Now, why would you say all, all of it. Rebellion. I've already opened this one, okay. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I know they don't plan on making DLC, but maybe they will implement it in... Um, maybe they will implement it in... Um, uh, in the next game, if they make a sequel. I could imagine they would make a sequel. This was a great success. I could picture them doing that. It's just a gorgeous country, that's true, Squish. It's a very beautiful country. Is Switzerland as rich and beautiful as Norway? Uh, I've never been to Norway, so I don't know how beautiful it is. I've just seen pictures, and those pictures were amazing, but... Professor Weasley? Hi, Lone. Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. The music is nice. So cool. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. 
shall we? After you, Professor. I like her. She's cute. <laughs> Such a sweet character, isn't she? I think she also has one of the best facial expressions. They announced a sequel already and an HBO show, really. Hi, Bunny Top. Hello. Comfy time. What is this? Hi, place? Living. This is the Room of Requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Revelio. A student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, where is Deke? He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Deke Professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. Oh, I'm learning the, the, the spell now, right? This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Okay, let's do that. Whoosh! Evanesco. Hi, Jaeger. Yes. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. All right, ma'am. Uh, where did it go? Ah, oh, here. Also. That was the wrong set. Excellent there you go. <laughs> work. You'll note that you are now Hi, in Witcher. possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. The Moonstone. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? <laughs> oh, what's this? Is that... Goodness, my old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Okay, A. Yes, Professor. I waited for here. I waited for you here for ages. Perhaps you were assigned a few more inches of parchment than you'd expected. Let me know if you want to try to meet again. Sincerely, T. A and T, eh? Hey? Dear me. If you keep it down, some of us are trying to rest. I'm sorry. It was an accident. She reminds me of the mother in Resident Evil 7. What? What was her name? Margaret Baker? Or something? She was... she was annoying, mate. Accio. Can I climb underneath or did I... Aha, uh -huh, no, I needed it, right? Okay. Repulsor. Okay. Wait, is there something else I could do here before I leave? Ah, okay, I think I remember. Ah, yeah, it's just the chest. Forest ivy scarf, and it looks very nice and green. I like what I see. Looks like a... Okay, it's a bit too hippie for my evil Slytherin. Would be good for a Hufflepuff uh, hippie character. Hey, Ryder, welcome in. Whee! Hi, nerd, welcome. Hey, Ardo. Locate that deke. <laughs> Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. It's gonna be fine. No, not. Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin. <laughs> well, that didn't work as they wanted to, I guess. Hi, Luxta, welcome. 
My lunch is not aged well. Wish I had found this bag earlier. <laughs> you. I was literally saying that when I uh, when I played this first and I got here. Bit offended the room thought I needed a bath, a cheeky thing. <laughs> well, sometimes you just need a bath because, not because you're smelly, but because it's just very relaxing. Oh. These lamps are so pretty. How Hi, does Mace. anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? How you doing, Mace? Welcome in. I think it's the um, it's the jar that makes me mind of Margaret Baker, but she's so sweet and kind. Not at all like Margaret Baker. What was that? A was snitch. that a golden snitch? It quite indeed was, yes. Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> <laughs> the lot. No, no. <laughs> oh, this part. I remember this. No, wait. I know. I remember that I had many approaches to this until I figured out that. What I had to do was totally not making sense in my in my head. Let me answer. Something like this. Thank you very much for the tea. Akio. Uh, I saw the prompt thingy. Oh, there was. Picks the perfect positioning. Haha, <laughs> 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 there you go. <laughs> I hope that house elf can find us in here. Oh. Slytherin gang. Hey, Oliver, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. So. Damn, my character is such a pretty boy. <laughs> Zinder, hi! Thank you so much for the for the three month resub. I hope you're doing good. Hello. Second time in here, and still has the sparkles in her eyes when encountering the Londons. Yas. <laughs> Might even happen on the third and the fourth time. Jewel Soul, thanks for the bits. Uh, if that is not Deke. Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, Hi, there Thea. you are! Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Hello. Ah, oh, Deke. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second. Aww. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Perfect. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Hi, David. Welcome in. Hi, Dio. Hi, Lewis. <laughs> Sheesh.
love this. <laughs> You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. Tink is so happy. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. All right, ma'am. You have unlocked the desk of description. Use it to reveal the magical properties of any unidentified gear that you've collected. I. Oh yeah, Kirill. I, I don't. I. Oh, this really bothers me too. But like clipping through, right? I wish they would at least shape the hair in the form that it would be in the hood. At least. This really bothers me too. Hmm. Maybe we need to let go and get a haircut. But I really like the long hair on him. I think it makes him... It reminds me of Lucius Malfoy in a way, you know? I think that's very fitting. Juso, thank you for the biddies earlier. Thank you very much. Head lover, hello. It's my dick and a buff. <laughs> oh, hi, free client. Welcome. Hi, Abood. Welcome. And Turin, hello. I don't have anything that I need to... Oh, I need to use it anyway. Okay. I don't have anything for this at the moment. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. All right. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Okay, teach away. Wow, let's go. Hey, Blossom, please say Very welcome. good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. True. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. Ah, they can also boring. be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Big brain. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Okay, let's do that. Da -da -da -da. Whoosh. So, small scientific, botanical, eclectic. Gothic. I think this might be a good fit for our character here, right? Whoosh. Okay, and then we want... Also the botanical one. Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Deke will be here to answer hey, any Kato. questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Hey, Multi, welcome. You can get a coat without a hood on, but it's not going to be a school robe, right? I'd like to show that I'm a Slytherin. 
Troldor, thank you very much for the first time sub with Prime. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. Welcome to the Chonkies. Enjoy the ad-free watching as well. Guys, welcome a first time subscriber with lots of Chonky Chonks in chat, please. Hi, Major Claire. Welcome in. Hi, Nick. Hello. Uh, I'd like to know more about Deke. Can you tell me a bit more about Deke? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have and seems to know it's every nook, cranny and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready. But again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. I think he's going to be very proud of all the potions I'm going to be brewing here. Yes, yes. The room of requirement building section is giving me fallout vibes. Do you feel the same? In a way, yeah. Hi, Roja. Hi, Ink. Hello. Um, I saw a mod that makes you gesture to cast spells. No more need to change or load spells pages. Ooh, nice. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. Okay. We've charms in place to enforce that. Got it. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the room of requirement has its own rules. Okay. It's the big exception. Hi, Guido. Hello. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da -da. So, are we no longer the lizards, but now the chonky? No, no, uh, Lurkstaff, you are still uh, a lizard. Everybody is a lizard, but if you're a subscriber, then you get the chonky emotes, the, the green lizard, right? This one. Um, which is called chonky. And then you become a chonky by subscribing, you know? So, everybody who's a follower? D make, making sense? Okay. <laughs> I just I just wanted a short quick name for the people who are subscribing as well. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Well, why are we already at it? Would you mind? I'm eager to learn whatever you can teach me. Complete the tasks I've given you and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo. The severing charm. Mm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. I love Defindo. It's one of my favorites to use. Speak with Professor Weasley. Deke hasn't seen this many plants. What? <laughs> what? Deke thinks what? You should... To be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Thank you, Deke. I haven't brewed a single potion in this room, but thank you. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Hey, Sean, Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. I already answered that, Boomly. <laughs> Guess you didn't didn't listen. Return to Professor Weasley. Heh! I literally just talked to you. What the hell? So confused. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Conjure wall decorations. Okay. I, I agree with you. Certain areas really do look at, look like it. Wall decorations. Wall hangings. Decorations. Da 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 da. Um. Ba -ba. Ba <gasps> Niffler! Niffler! Absolutely. I want a Niffler painting. Absolutely. Gazing wizard portrait. Nimva, thank you so much. Thank you very much for the first time sub with Prime as well. Welcome to the Chonkies. Thank you so much. Nurse and baby portrait. Uh, house elves and mistress portrait. I want to make it small. 
Shmoy. What's this? Yeah, I'm gonna remove again. Proud of all the potions you <laughs> You're getting ahead of yourself, my friend. Beast diagram. Oh, that's handy. Oh, that's wow, that's massive. <laughs> that's what she said. Deke hasn't seen this many plants here before. Yeah, me neither. There's literally no plant at all. <laughs> oh man, Deke. Deke cannot believe how many beasts you have here. I don't even have beasts here. <laughs> what are you talking about, Deke? <laughs> oh, he's literally talking about things that I haven't even done yet. Imagine this would be my first playthrough and he's literally talking about things that I haven't encountered yet. Floor decorations, let's go. <laughs> Uh, of course, there's looting things without realizing it. What do you mean? Kyotori, hi, Kimak. Thank you very much. Hi, bro. Welcome. Ba, ba, da, da, ba. Five floor decorations, really. Gonna go with the gothic stuff, right? And then I can change the colors, too. Da, 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 da. Oh man. Can you tell that I listen to this music a lot? Are they completely round ones? No, that's a bit of a shame. Wow! Dick thinks you should, should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Uh huh. Thanks, mate. It's so big. <laughs> Good work. Thanks. Shall we move on? Yes, please. Yes. I've conjured everything I can. Hi, Parsley, to hate him. Hi, Zendi. I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Okay. I just listened to a few of your songs, uh... On your listings page, and after hearing Imagine, I came back and saw the least I could do. Hey, no, thank you very much. I appreciate that. We have these goals in the top of the screen. Um, they're When they're filled, they're green, red, and blue bars. The ones in the top of the screen, right? And each one unlocks a song that I sing at the end of the stream. And if all three are full, there's two bonus songs on top of that. And then we also have a channel point redemption for even more songs. So there's up to six songs that I sing at the end of the stream. Half concert sometimes. <laughs> Psycho, thank you for the first time sub as well. Welcome to the Chonkies. Guys, another first time subscriber. Hi, Crossenth. These daily potion dose seem to be a bit too much for him, apparently. <laughs> Oh, yeah, maybe. I wonder, is this red bar a bit faster when you play on hard? I heard her welcome. Hi, Gorn. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. All right. Why? Oh, I'm just gonna place it somehow. Deke uh, alter the style of an item. Okay. Change the Deke color of an item. How many beasts you have here? I know, right? Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you brewed. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Adjust the size of an item. Mm 
Nicely done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. Ooh. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. We're gonna go full gothic for this character. Yes, please. from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Ambiance? Would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Hi, Deke. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. Hi, Happy. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? A cool moonlit ambiance sounds perfect. I'd like something natural and early. I focus best in a room that is dark and mysterious. So either moonlit or this. Let's see. I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie. As if I'm in the forbidden forest, surrounded by shadows. Oh, huh. sounds perfect. Let's see. Ooh, perfect. That's really perfect. Why is Geralt in Hogwarts? Because I love, I love Geralt and I love Hogwarts. Mm -hmm. So why not? <laughs> Quite a difference. Welcome in. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Hey, Thank Blackheart. you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. <laughs> Wish. Damn. Wow. An even bigger space. How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spell crafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. We heard that before. Hi, Xander, for a welcome. Hi, Twin. Good to Wonderful. see you. Hi, Warlord. La. Okay. So this does already... Gothic. Papa. The walls don't really look that gothic, do they? Do I have to change every single wall like this? Ugh. That's gonna be a bit annoying. I thought it's gonna change everything at once, or do I have to just do that um, in the balcony in the in the main room? Sound is a bit annoying. Okay. Okay, for now. Ooh. I don't like the. I don't like these. I just put them up because that was my quest. 
Whoosh. Okay, so... Can I now actually brew stuff? Oh, I don't have Dittany leaves. There you go. Talk about Geralt. I'll finally start playing the next gen soon. I hope they fixed a couple of bugs. Yeah, I think they did. There were some updates recently, actually. With all the loot that Liz will acquire, we need storage space. I'm not gonna acquire that much loot this playthrough because I'm not gonna do many side quests. I, th I think this will change a few things. I wish I could change the color of this. Da, 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 da. Okay, how long does it take for- oh, that's gonna take a while. Okay, I want to check if I have... If I've bought the bigger tables already? No, I have not. Or do you unlock them later on? Composts and composters. And chopping stations. I haven't even- I haven't even used that. Okay, cool. Nice, nice. So I guess we will continue here with uh, this room another time. Or are we not done yet? Do I have a quest? Deke, do I have a quest? <laughs> What's going on? Why didn't you press left once? I don't know either. Flight test, Professor Sharp's assignment two. In the shadow of the Undercroft. Purchase a room. This is totally necessary. So, let's go to Hogsmeade. Is this the room one? Yes, okay. Liz, you're a loot goblin and we know it. Yeah, true, but I'm not gonna do many side quests. I'm not gonna do exploring that much. And that is where you get all the dro uh, all the all the loot from. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Uh, instead of pressing A, you hold to change all at once. Oh, really? Oh, thanks. Thank you very much. Didn't know that. <laughs> But then again, I had like 30% or so um, completion in the Room of Requirement challenge in my first playthrough because it's cool and all, but I'm, I feel so like Sim, you know, like um, The Sims. Ah, new face. Wonderful. Okrakai, hi. I think you were meant to type in your pin somewhere else instead of my chat, I think. Hello. Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. I had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. Show me what you got. What are we looking for today? Hogwarts house broom. Ember dash broom. Moon trimmer broom. That item is of the highest quality. Yeah, definitely this one. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Can I sell you stuff? Nice doing business with you. Because I need some coin, master. Um, and Morrigan, welcome in. Uh, Psycho, hello. Floor so beautiful. Also, took the carpets away, right? <laughs> Bigger tables, if you can buy them. Yeah, yeah, I, I wasn't sure if I bought them already. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! <laughs> Knew hmm. I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. 
What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while, if I'm right. The new upgrade well, it... ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Revelio. It's a bit nasty that he makes makes you pay for it, right? Ah, <sighs> can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. <sighs> Hi, Cookie. Hello. And number nine, hello. I hope you're doing good. Uh, oops. Oh, hot tub. I hear. I hear a hot tub. Hot tub. Ooh Hey John, hi Phoenix. Hey Lo. Do you think you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed? <laughs> Many kisses and love lizards. <laughs> uh, thanks for lurking, Bloomby. Have a have a good day. Hi cats. Is this first time playing notes in the title as well? It's uh it's my second playthrough. We just finished uh, my Ravenclaw playthrough recently. And uh, now we're testing the dark arts. I I haven't learned the, the curses in my first playthrough. Speak with Imelda Rice. Oh, I saw a page over there. You come here. Wow. <laughs> Did you Google it, Musantia? Uh, there should be a few more pages in Hogsmeade that ought to help me level up a little bit. Five more, and then we get a little level up soonish. I mean, oh, that was a bird. <laughs> Do you guys also have that when you're running around through Hogwarts or Hogsmeade and you're looking for pages and then suddenly Akio. Damn, and then You realize there's Revenue. actually not a Not a page Oopsie poopage Akio. There you go, okay three more Typical hot tub streamer, yeah <sighs> Horrible, right? Such a cliche. Sitting here half naked. <clears throat> uh huh. Oh, I see what you've done there. Give me your coin. Is that a uniform free day? Where's the <laughs> where's the Tylers? Maybe tomorrow or so. I felt like hoodie today. Felt like being comfy. Was it like three more pages or so? Oh, 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 oh. My mom had chairs and like tables exactly looking like this in the garden. Aha. Akio. When you have to change your pa panically have to change your your um spell set. 
Damn it, does the duck need some clothes? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, there's another one of these chests. Sorry. Is that a page up there? I think I saw some magic. Oh yeah, there we go. One more, one more chat, one more. And then we can move on with our lives. Liz, I'm not gonna do any... Any side quests, also Liz running through. <laughs> running through Hogsmeade doing this. Ah, my, my favorite part of this. Hmm. Pop balloons. These rocks have seen better days. Okay, so... I think I can't do this one yet, maybe. So I was thinking maybe, ooh, maybe I'm gonna do some of these side things uh, off off stream. So like Merlin Trials and the Dedalian Keys. Because it is a bit tedious and probably boring for you guys to watch again. Oh. <laughs> Hot tub is over. <laughs> so, oh. I was... Was that an owl or was it a... It looked a bit chunky for a paper page thingy. Could try to get a new haircut, right? So that's not clipping anymore, but I literally didn't really like any of the haircuts. Hi Jamie, welcome in. Hi NT, hello. Does eye chest make you feel so guilty, but 500 gold, right? They like whimpering like a little doggo and it's just like ugh, heartbreaking. Okay, that was a... Not a page. Professor Random. A first-time subscriber here on my channel. Thank you so much. Guys, please welcome a first-time subscriber on this channel. With lots of chonky chonks in chat. Thank you so much for the support. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. And the ad free watching. Thank you, thank you. Welcome, Professor. Don't like the haircut lady, she's a bully? She's a bully? What did she do to you? I'm gonna go talk to her. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Oy. He's gonna say the exact same lines like the female character, I. I see you, Paige. Aha, there you go. Dum dum da dum dum. Empower! Prime sub, thank you so much as well for the first time, Prime sub. Thank you. Field guide pages. Whoosh, whoosh. Okay. Making a little bit of progress here. So now, um, I think I wanted to go to the Quidditch thing, right? Hi, boy, welcome. Hi, Burrows Gaming. After obtaining room of requirement, uh, Deke becomes our house elf, right? He's not ours, but um, I know what you mean, yeah. Um. Hello from Iceland. Wow, hello. Greetings from Switzerland. But I am originally from uh, the Danish border of northern Germany. I always said that I travel broadens the mind. Constable, get out. <laughs> That line! I'm so glad that Silencio mod is a thing. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. My least favorite character. If it isn't Slytherin's newest brim talent. Maybe she's less competitive when she's in the same house as you. Hello, Imelda. Albie Weeks sent me. 
did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. You sound jealous. <laughs> uh, have you... Have you heard about the PlayStation 5 exclusive quest? Yes, I've heard about it. <laughs> Hi, Hoybit, welcome. Think good someone's health. jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. Bumbling but for baboons? for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You can't be what passes for Slytherin these days. Pfft, ragged old hats dropping at standards. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Slytherin. Let's go. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. <laughs> oh dear. Success. Uh -oh! Now that's more like it. Blah. Camera sometimes just refuses to turn around. The boy who lived has come to die. <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn this. It's gonna have like I sucked at it. Oh man. You can learn. It's just practice, I guess. How flying with a controller probably feels better than mouse and keyboard. Ah, since I haven't tried it yet, I don't know. Hi love, hello. Oh, Imelda. Ugh, that's not... You, you must have cheated, you... Ugh. Fine. You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Mm -hmm. Surely my win means sure. something. Uh, you're not terrible. But you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Okay. <laughs> She's so horrible. <laughs> I don't want your respect. All right. Yeah, screw this. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Random, thank you very much for the 100 biddies. And Hufflepuffs, Puffs, thank you very much for gifting a sub. Thank you, thank you. I suspect Mr. Weeks Hi, would be glad to hear how I fared. Thank you. Hey, Lord Dragon. 
Liz believes she can fly. I do. A little bit. But let's fast travel there. Um, Hawksmeat map. Then we need to fix the hair clipping through the clothes. They do, Dino. Absolutely, I agree. I'm with you on this. First gift sub on the channel too. Thank you, Huff and Puffs. Thank you, thank you. I don't even remember who was it. It's been so too long. Who <laughs> cares about your respect, Hi, <laughs> DK. Whoosh. Oh, you're back. We've something to report, I hope. Aye. Put down the quaffle. Mr. Wheat, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible. Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Voosh. Oh, thank you. Not mm. the voosh. That's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. Aye. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling Sally. about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Thank you guys for the bits. Hmm. Thank you, Salvi. How Thank you, Drew. How address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? <laughs> Quest complete. Flight test. And thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. Hi, Drew. Good to see you. Okay, so... Professor Sharp's assignment two. Acquire and use an invisibility potion. Acquire and use a thunderbird potion against enemies. Aha, okay. So I just need to use the invisibility potion and then the thunderbird one needs to be used in combat. It's locked still, okay. Then we gotta go here. Go to our good friend Pippin. Oh, stuck. <laughs> this is a, 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 a chick game. What would you uh, say is a chick game? There are some chickens running around. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Uh, does anybody here use the Accio Clarity Reshade? What is that? What can I do for you today? Mentors, hi! Thank you for the 11 month resub. Uh, invisibility potion recipe. Can I sell you some stuff? Yeah, let's go. I don't know if I'm gonna use it much, but I'd rather be able to brew it myself. A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. What's the audio effect called after subbing? Uh, alert? <laughs> I need troll boogies to make this one. Invisibility, thunder brew. I think I already have a thunder brew. No, do I? Thunderbrew. Okay, I have zero out of this. So I need Shrivel Fig Fruit, Stench of the Dead, and Troll Boogie. Okay. The Dead, Troll Boogie, and Shrivel Fig Fruit. Pega! Thank you so much for the 1,200 bits. Thank you so much, my friend. What can I do it's for you? It's very sweet today? of you. So I need the boogies. A wise decision. And this. Thank you. And then the fruit I can get here, right? Okay. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Mm-hmm. Ash 
Kushka, thank you for the three gifted subs. Thank you so much. Everybody enjoy the emotes and the FP watching. You can buy directly. Yeah, but it's uh, insanely... Uh, I would rather learn... I would rather learn the um, the recipe and then be able to make it myself instead of buying it once and then have to buy it all the time, you know, when I need it. Um, I just like to be free and like be able to do stuff myself. I think he means the actual sound you do. No, it's called Kulning, not Kooning. <laughs> cool, Kulning. This is how you spell it. Uh, gosh, now I forgot where I needed to go. Do I need to go to the magic neep or do I need to go to the other one? Let's try this. This is closer. Out of the way, woman! <sighs> Hello, be with you in a bit. This one, right? Through the fig fruit. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Actually, let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yeah, I want to be able to make all of this myself. No one can Hi, say Chris. I don't Hello. Golden, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Thank you, guys. Da -da. Okay, so let's go back to the uh, room of requirement and then make our own potions. Room of requirement. Hi, David. Can you make your own what? Ooh, this looks cool. I like it. So, um, invisibility potion. I'm gonna make more of these potion table thingies. It's not where I wanted to place it, but okay. Thunder brew. Hi, second counselor. Welcome in. I just YouTube cooling, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? So, the sounds that you hear when somebody subscribes or gift subs or cheers bits or donates or whatever, um, my, my alert sounds, I make them myself. There's a few that are unique that um, you can see in the panels if you want, but uh, the, the that's my voice. So, in case you wondered. My favorite type of magic. Flash Bomanshi. Hey, Maria. Welcome. Hi, Disney. Hello. Hi, Roderick. I'm good. How are you doing? Hello. Happy Friday. I won't be able to play Hogwarts Legacy until next month since I have a PlayStation 4. Ah, yeah, I understand. How's being evil going? Well, you can't be as evil as I as I thought you could. The answers are still pretty pretty sweet, I'd say. Okay, so use an invisibility potion. Is it this one? I don't understand how this is better. 
I don't understand how this is any better than the than this. This looks even more invisible than the other one, so I don't understand the the fuss about it. But okay, you should, should be, be proud, proud of all, all the potions, potions you've brewed. brewed. Mm -hmm. I know. Thank you, Deke. So, world map. Forbidden forest. Is there anything that I could... Is there anything that I could fight, maybe? Let's travel here and then fly around until we can use the, the Thunder Brew Potion in combat. Hey, Cosmic. Yeah, the Lash Woman. She is uh, from The Witcher 2. Nice. I like when people know... The Witcher 1 and 2 as well. Most people really like Witcher 1, but they never... Uh, Witcher 3, but they never really checked out Witcher 1 and 2, which are such good games. Hi, Sean Blue. Hello. Okay, let's go find some some quarrel and let's find some, some... Somebody to fight. Hello? <laughs> Come on, there's... There's probably some enemies here somewhere, right? Aha! Okay, wait. Um... Ah, oh, I don't know this one yet. That's a bit of a shame. Against enemies, okay. I'm stuck. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. <laughs> Expelliarmus. No, no, no. I can't see. I can't see. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh my god! Incendio. Really? Where's, where's this other guy coming from? I can't see because there's either grass or clouds everywhere. <laughs> this was really not the best idea to go to this part. Oof. Oh, Ashkov is going to, to bed. Good night, Ashkov. Sleep well. Thank you so much. I'm sorry that I missed the message. Have a good night. Sleep well. Oh, really? I have to do the thing again? But now the the, the duck bog thing... Oh, I hate these. Especially without the... My favorite spell. But why are the... Oh, oh man. Yeah. It's so annoying that when you focus on on enemies and then there's bushes and grass everywhere and you literally can't see crap. Okay, this should be better. Ah, damn. Too late! Return to Professor Sharp. Let's go. Nubar, thank you very much for the 10 bucks. You wouldn't believe how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu power. <laughs> oh man, Nubar, why? <laughs> Tell me why. 
Why would you do that? Thank you very much for the 10 bucks though, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi, Raul. Hola, Liz, what's going on? We're fighting. Hi, Liz, lay joiner in the Slytherin playthrough. Hi, daddy, welcome. Why, why, why do you always, why do people call themselves daddy? What, this is just, the parent. Hi, the parent. Hello. <laughs> All these daddies in my chat, sheesh. Um. Uh, the 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 Hogwarts. Mm, library, library. Yes, there you go. Hi, stranger. Welcome. Can we take a wiggle well potion? As it was a water. <laughs> Hi, Roger. Welcome. I know red beer. I know. I know about the tongue thing. But you can't see that, but um, oftentimes it's on cooldown, so I can't I can't really do anything, you know. Hello, Professor have you finished Shaw. your assignments? I have indeed. I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Have you spent all your talent points? No, I haven't. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Okay. Now. Let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Are you ready? Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Ah, my favorite spell. So far. Hmm. Very good. <laughs> it seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom. Okay. The window. It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Right. This is hardly the place. Hardly the place for what? Um. Hi, Daniel. Welcome in. Hi, Super Blade. The dude looks just like a witch. A witch. Which dude now? Same barber. <laughs> Uh, what's up? Found you on YouTube and came for Hogwarts Legacy. Greeks from Germany. Hey, a fellow German. Hello. Hi, Burata. Welcome. Back, by the way, short meeting became less than a short meeting. Oh, uh, a bit, a bit more than a short meeting, huh? Okay. Now I have five wig and well potions better than nothing, I guess. So let's see what we can do now, shall we? Thank you, Pega. Saw the message now. <laughs> uh, quests. A demanding delivery. Ooh, summoning court match. Oh no. Um, in the shadow of the undercroft. Let's go. Meet Sebastian. Where do I meet him? Can you unlock Avada Kedavra? This is the plan for this playthrough. I haven't done it in my first. And in this playthrough, I plan to, to learn the curses. <laughs> and yeah, Trixiel's welcome in. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome. So, meet Sebastian. I hope I didn't travel f too far away. If only a new student would help me with my sad predicament. Oh, yeah. Horrible. That guy's totally sus, waiting at the same spot than I, huh? Over here. <laughs> I'm literally right in front of you, mate. I was just chilling on the floor. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. 
I have something to show you. <laughs> First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Mm -hmm. Understood. Mm -hmm. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. Are you sure? This way. How do you know? Okay, I'm totally not super suspiciously a following. passage just here. It's well disguised. Can you unlock the curse as a Gryffindor? You can unlock the curses as any character. But I like to roleplay things and I prefer to like I was I was uh, being a good student, I was being a good Ravenclaw kid, and I just didn't see that this would go well together to to play a good character, Ravenclaw, and then lowering the curses and kill everything. Nah, nah, nah. So now we do it as an evil character. Hi, first Kate. <laughs> he asked them. Uh, Professor, do you know about the Undercroft? The what now? Oh, okay, you don't know. Okay, good. Anyway, bye. <laughs> How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. Revelio, I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. Of he course. He never confides in any. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. Too we late. We to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. Yeah, now, now I'm here, so <laughs> things are gonna change. <laughs> Um, Lucia's style. <laughs> the joys of dog ownership. I miss having a dog, to be honest. Mm. Hi, Bruno. Thank you. <laughs> uh, what clover? Good stream. Hey, Adam. Thank you very much. I know Ominous. Met him in our common room. I've noticed he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it, and I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, Mention this to no one, mm -hmm. especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets, but this place is special to him. Of course. Ominous spoke to me about his family when we first met. To say that he has no love lost for them is an understatement. Glad you understand. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the blasting curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. That's ridiculous. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. Teach away. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Maybe that was an achievement for getting all the spells, but nope. Mm. I love that the potions professor is like, here's the finder, you can use it to chop your ingredients or murder people. Not my problem. <laughs> Is this gonna win game of the year? I have no idea, but I think it would be a good uh, candidate for it, in my opinion. Do you consider including mods? Uh, I have a mod already active. It's called Silencio, which mutes the flu flames lady. Man, she was going on my nerves. Whoosh. 
Hi, Phil. More happy Friday to you as well. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Stick to the targets, though. Best to keep the Undercroft intact. Revelio. those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a Confringo cast travels a bit farther than that of a spell like Incendio. Oh, Incendio is big poo. Confringo. Confringo. Nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. You'll get used to it. That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. Fire rule, hello my friend, how are you? Hey, there's someone with my name. <laughs> how are you doing my friend? Good to see ya. Yeah, Fire Rule, we have three new mods. We have Pega, Squish and Drax now as mods. I'm super grateful to have more people in the team. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. Hi, Drixen. Hello, and thanks for the lurk. We have uh, no lurk command, but we have a channel point redemption for like 69 points or so, which is nothing. Um, and that is uh, how you guys can show that you're lurking without speaking up in chat if you don't want to. So just, just to let you know. And thanks for all the follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. It's almost too much. What? I'm ready for more spells like this. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. Mm. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do. Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. Our character reminds me of Draco Malfoy's father. Wonder if that's intentional. Uh, he's supposed to look like a young Geralt of Rivia, more like. I'm a big Witcher fan. Sorry, but I mean, like, could you play in all the houses? Uh, you, you can choose each house, but each one needs to be, of course, its own playthrough. So you can make a character for Ravenclaw, one for Slytherin, one for Hufflepuff, and one for Gryffindor. Yeah, you could, you could play in all the houses. And yes, you could also learn the curses in each house. Hi, betters. Welcome in. Happy food time. <laughs> Enjoy your food. But Geralt isn't evil. That is true. But come on, doesn't he look perfect for it? T tell me otherwise. Doesn't he scream, noble-born, pure-blood fanatic Slytherin? I mean, I, I think so. <laughs> uh, you could come along, meet Anne. Uh, okay. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me about the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. I'm playing super evil also this Niffler! <laughs> Ravenclaw's the best. I agree. I I am I am a Ravenclaw. Like my first playthrough was Ravenclaw, and I've been Ravenclaw for many, many years, apparently, due to like chosen by the, the website and stuff, and I always felt like I would fit it into Ravenclaw best. So, yep, I agree. Ravenclaw is awesome. This, it's pronounced Gary by the river. Hi, <laughs> Shen. It's like Lucius Malfoy and Gary of Rivia had a baby. Hmm. The 
the book I found in the restricted section was missing some pages. That's about it. Pity. Didn't think you'd disappoint me with so vague an answer. Sorry. I suppose with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, a bit more time practicing the blasting curse is in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. Okay, I'll try. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. La -da, la -da, la -da. How are you doing, Shen? Welcome in. Ah, oh. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there? I can hear you. Oh, uh, hello, Ominous. I was just heading to our common room. Uh -oh. I recognize that voice. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? <laughs> Actually, Sebastian brought me there, but he made it perfectly clear to keep quiet about it. That rat! You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster, uh, mm -hmm. and I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. My daddy! <laughs> you needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your undercroft. Why should I trust you? You just betrayed Sebastian. Please. I was trying to defend him. He was clear that this was a secret place and I was to tell no one. He's a good friend. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Oh my God, oh, the drama. I, just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian <sighs> is going to get an earful about this. I'm out of here, bye. <laughs> Too much drama. Keep this between us five years later. Hey guys! <laughs> Hello! <Rebellion. laughs> Have you seen me on the croft yet? Let's let's tell everybody. Let's... Hey! Hey girl! You with your stinky game. There's the undercroft just around the corner. Go check it out. Bye, see you next time. He has a point, I know. Never forget what that Ufflepuff girl said in 1421. What lovely stone. Oh, that's class, that is. <laughs> oh, sweet. Okay, so what's the next quest we can do? When my father hears about this. <laughs> Uh, I don't think the Elder Wand was much stronger than the other wand, as it is depicted. It's just choosing the strongest wizard. Maybe. Maybe it's just the about the connection, the wizard combo with a wand, you know. The map chamber. Report to Professor Fig. Okay. Do you hear the Baron yet? No, not at all. Have you looked it up? Because for me, that's a completely different character. I, have you confirmed that it is the, the actor? Just found the perfect location for a game. Hi, Kosoi, welcome. Must be a message board in the school for such announcements like, uh, there is the end of Underworld. Wait, this way? Wrong door. Oh, go going down? No. Report to prof- I'm so confused. Report to professor- Oh, I need to go to his- oh, oops. But it said something about the map chamber, I'm so confused. Report to Professor Fig. I need to tell him about the- okay, never mind. <gasps> professor Garlic's assignment! Wee! Wa wa wee wa. Oh, this one seems to be close. I haven't found anything online yet, but I'll check again. I think it sounds quite different from the Baron. We're talking about the bloody Baron, right? Philip Stranger? 
Do the wand cores actually make a difference? Not for the gameplay, no. Not to my knowledge. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. No. Good morning. Hi, April. Welcome. La da 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 dum dum da 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 dum. Yeah, the bloody baron. Okay. We are doing a rave in the Undercroft weekend before uh, owls. Don't tell the Hufflepuffs. <laughs> That's lovely. Go for physic garlic. While I was on Team Garlic at first, I have to admit that in the end, Poppy stole my heart or the heart of my character. Yeah, Poppy is the sweetest. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. I received a flurry of messages from Professor Black's house elf, Scrope. Scrope sent you messages? Yes. I thought it was odd too. He asked me to meet him and then told me to take the toast. Why would you want to take toast? To a cave under the lake. That's where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was we hoping shall. you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Let's go! Hi, Kaiser. Welcome in. Hi, Eliza. Good to see you. Hi, Heimdall. <laughs> the hashtag garlic. <laughs> the room is called the map chamber, by the way. And the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them. And Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. <laughs> Damn you, Peeves. All oh, cats are being extra cuddly. To Aww. think it was beneath us all this time. Mind blowing. Hi, Illusional. Welcome. <laughs> Blasted peeves, right? <laughs> this room is so cool. I think the design is so beautiful. The stone is even moving. Could he see this magic? That was tra traces of ancient magic, right? Could he? Could he just see that? I love magic. <laughs> A man. Hogsmeade. And over here, the Forbidden Forest. And of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. Hi, Ectoplasma. Thank you very much for the resup. If only you were here to see this. Oh, poor guy lost his wife. Hector, thank you very much for the two month reset with Prime. Enjoy the emotes. Welcome back. I don't think he was able to see the magic around the book. Yeah, but he placed the m book once the, the magic poured out of the pedestal where you could put it on right up there. So it was a bit sus. <laughs> Thank you, Sam. Thank you very much. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. 
And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vault in Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the Keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. Yeah. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news, indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Mm-hmm, okay. Shall we have a look? Hi, I know that tower. I it's not far. Stuff. You may have seen it yourself. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. So glad you're back to Hogwarts Legacy. I've been rewatching your what's what so I could play along with you, really. <laughs> Meet Professor Fig at the tower, okay. Yeah, we're gonna do a playthrough of this. Oh, I got two new talents. Where's the one where v that rev increases Revelio? Is that later? Spell set. Oh, do I already have that? I feel like Revelio's is a bit, you know, limited. Down dodge, ancient truth, magic, blah, blah. Oh man, all of these are pretty amazing. Cast slice through impacted enemies. Oh, this one is really good. Oh god, there's so many good ones! I don't know which one to take. Ah! Go with these. Okay, I'm gonna use this a lot, I know. And then... Confringo impacts produce fe fury bolts that seek enemy targets. That's also pretty handy dandy. Let's go with this. Um, 
I got another letter, really? Hmm. And we got new gear as well. Is it better? It actually is, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> oh hell nah. Oh hell nah. Oh hell <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I, I, I think most of the, the gear is actually a bit over the top with the designs. I prefer the... That's quite the improvement. By the stats. <laughs> Sir Geralt of Rivia. Could be running around like this without a... Thingy me bob bobs. Like a... What's it called? The, the, the cloak. Is under stealth? Revalues? Oh, it's under... Oh, okay. Okay, first we do the Professor Garlic assignment for obvious reasons. Uh, Talents point are just too hard to choose, as I said earlier. I maxed out three of the five areas. I had stealth maxed out and then... Wait, I'm gonna show you. I had spells, core, and stealth maxed out, and then I had a few in the room of requirement and dark arts I didn't use in my first playthrough. Now I intend to go with mostly uh, like dark arts, core, and spells, so these three. That's the plan for this playthrough. The dark arts one is so overpowered. I'm gonna go into dark arts once I get to the dark arts part. Hi Alicia, welcome, how are you doing? Acquire and use of- oh, wait, oh. Oh. Acquire and use of Mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously, oops. Oh god, where do I get the Venomous Tentacular? That's the... Is that up here? This one, right? I think. Yeah, I agree. I've had trouble finding other gear I like, other than the class uniforms. I really like the class uniforms, right? That place is right? Okay, thank you, Dino. It's under it's core from level 16 on. Oh, okay. So now we don't have the clipping with the hair anymore. But I think it... Oh man, I prefer... Oh. I swear I just saw a pa Ooh. Can you come here? I think I prefer the look with the uh, with the cloak, so maybe I have to just cut the cut the hair. Although I really like this hairstyle. Ugh. Ugh. Have a look around. I'll be with you in just a minute. Finish your essay. Ooh, good job, Such Alicia. A wee bairn gie a thrashing to a troll. Oh, I can't, well, I can't I believe it. We show you some of what's available. Oh my, I can't even afford it. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Doors uh, always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Mandrakes. Oh no, I don't have mandrakes. Oof. I guess I need to explore a little bit to get some coin, eh? Quiet and use a venomous tentacular. Well, I could just pop it down here, but it's not gonna... It's probably not gonna do anything, oh. right? So... I don't know, explosive, hello, but uh, somebody else said it today, so I guess you might be on the right track there with a voice from Horizon from Apex. Whoosh. There's an eye chest in here. Yeah, I already got it. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Can I do this now? I think I should be able to do this now. Expelliarmus, Akio, 
All the supporters. Uh, uh, I think I need this. Good for you. Yep. Oh, hiding behind another one. You old cheap. What's that? Settled. Took me more than half an hour and traveled home that before I found where to buy Mendrake Seasol. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is the first. <laughs> Usually I stand inside of it and not on top of it. Okay. <laughs> that's cu that's cool. Um, oh man, that was a perfect chance to actually use a venomous tentacula and fight, right? <sighs> Maybe I'll find some other monsters close by. Oh man, they did such a good job with the broom flying. Whoosh. Oh, there was a chest. Hello? Thanks. Hmm. So I kind of have to explore to first off get the coins to actually uh, be able to purchase certain items. And also I need to get the... Oh, wait. I oh, know that was for, for, for gathering beasts, right? The paw print. Exoit! That's an entire year! Hello! Thank you so much for 12 months of support. Welcome back to the Chonkies. Enjoy the emotes, the ad free watching. Thank you very, very much. Aha! Uh -huh. Thornback shooter. Okay. Did both of them die? Okay, cool. So, I want this game so bad, but can't seem to find info if it supports. Oh, hey, Majelli. I have no clue about that, but maybe we can find something real quick um, in the settings. Uh, would it be here? Or here? Hmm. Maybe this. I don't know if it. What's this? Resolution? Rendering resolution. None. So I think. I think it de maybe depends on the monitor you have, I guess. I think I I know that one of my my friends is playing it on a higher resolution. Not this high, I guess, but high enough. Hi Frischchen, hello. Hi Exo, I thank you so much for the support for an entire year. I feel like I finish enemies too quickly that I don't think fast enough to use the plants unless it's like a troll or a bunch of them that I'm fighting. Well, as long as you're getting done what is meant to be done i think you're doing good right and as long as you're having fun because this is the whole point of playing video games in my opinion the devs really should have taken the time to fix the hair clipping i think i i can't think of many games that actually f um completely fix the hair clipping in video games not a single one where there's no clipping at all. Where not hair is glitching somehow in bodies or through clothes or some something like that. Unless they do options like putting a hat on and then the hair is completely under the, the, the head and then there is no hair anymore, basically. Hi, Aroni. 
new here, the Thrustmaster, what's the selling point? What do you mean with the selling point? I don't understand. I have Xbox Elite and the Stick Drift is meh, okay. Um, I can't- I, I would like to answer your question, but I don't understand what the selling point is. What's the difference? The difference to what? To the Xbox controller? <laughs> the two controllers. You mean the eSwap S versus the eSwap X? Um, never mind. I would like to help you, but I need I need information. Like the two controllers could you were talking about. Um, you could be talking about the Xbox controller because you were talking about an Xbox controller, and now you're just saying the two controllers. So I'm trying to figure out what you want to know. I cannot help if I don't know what you're talking about. That's why I'm asking questions. I'll follow the link. Okay. I would have helped, but I, I cannot answer questions that I don't understand. I can't assume something, but I hate assuming. I, I would much rather actually understand what people are talking about and then give the proper answer instead of just assuming what people are talking about. Because I have too little information from the questions and then giving, like, the wrong answer. <clears throat> So, uh, wait, what is my job, actually, right now? I'm, I'm confused, hang on. Uh, acquire and use a mandrake on multiple enemies, and I need a shit ton of money for this. Maybe I just go through one of the hamlets and try to open all the chests or something. Yeah, I'm alright, I can, I can assume as well, but I think assuming is not the right approach when people are asking questions. That's my approach. I, I am asking counter questions if I don't understand the question correctly, or if there's too many, uh, like there's there's multiple outcomes now of to the question, you know what I mean? I, of like course, I can do it like you and bottle. just assume Dark what they're talking about, the I but I don't like that. <laughs> Hi Adela, welcome in. I'm just this taking your coin. I'm not careful. I'm just take your coin. Hmm, can't open. Great. I get what you mean. I also think it's just it's just when people really want to get an answer, they can they can give you all the information you need to properly answer the question. And sometimes Maybe they could just Google. <laughs> but I would love to answer the questions about Thrustmaster. I mean, I'm an ambassador. I, I'm helping wherever I can. But there were too many options for the question, and I wanted to specify. I didn't buy the eSwap X because I'm, I'm, I'm an ambassador, as I just said. Uh, do you want... <laughs> Do you want to know why I prefer the X over the S? Is that the actual question? Why do I prefer the eSwap S over the eSwap X? Yes, okay, there, finally we get to the question. <laughs> so, um, there's quite a few differences, but my main reason why I prefer this controller is, as you can see, I can have the PlayStation controller layout, so I can have the, um, the, the analog sticks, I can have them like this, so that they are next to each other. I could take this out, and then I could replace it with a D-pad and have the, the stick here, and then have the D-pad down here, which is the classic Xbox layout, right? But I prefer this. Also, this is heavier, has quite a few changes. There's more buttons on the back that you can program. Um, you can take out the sides and can buy different colored ones. Um, the the wire has like this cloth thing around it and uh, 
the the plug here is more stabilized so it doesn't like just randomly flip out or uh, it's a bit more secured and yeah some other things but these are the, the major points is it wireless no <laughs> it's not wireless and you cannot use it wireless either Oh, this doesn't do anything. I'm playing with my back buttons right now. Hey, Lars, welcome in. Hi, Sky Shadow. What brand is that again? That's a Thrustmaster. You can type an exclamation mark e swap as it is in the title, and then you, you get to the website. I have a question. Is it easier to control with controller than with mouse and keyboard? Seems okay with mouse and keyboard, but I don't know how to fight, really. Oh, you have to click the buttons like this. Okay. How did I do Protego all of a sudden? Oh, no. I, I would remap it. I would totally remap the buttons. I don't like how it's mapped, but apart from that, I guess you could play it like this, yeah. Can you put in four sticks? You could put in three sticks because the... These buttons here, they are set. You cannot take out these. Hi, Dras. Welcome. Happy Friday. Hi, Gita. Welcome. Hi, Roblox. Hey, Play. Hello. Welcome. And hi, Rain. Good to see you. Happy Friday as well. The controller. This one is the Thrustmaster eSwap X Pro. X. This one. So, where was I? Acquire the Mandrake. I need coin. How much coin do I need? Does anybody know by heart how much coin one needs? Revelio. Mandrake. On multiple enemies. So, remember to myself, don't kill them too quickly. There's not enough space. Um. Hi, Parma. Welcome in. Is that Harry Potter? No. This is Hogwarts Legacy. <laughs> a quick sure out. A quick Google a says like 500 galleons for two mandrakes for two. Okay. Up a hog's field is being terrorized by Ran Rock's law. Oh no, let's see maybe we can sell some stuff. I do think I have new things. This I can sell. Okay, maybe I can sell some stuff. It's not right. I couldn't help but overhear. Did you mention Ran Rock's loyalists? I did. <sighs> Never imagined they'd act this deadly. I'm Claire Beaumont, by the way. Nice to meet you. Ran Rock and his followers have set up camp here. No regard for our beloved Hamlet or our livelihoods. Ruthless. My brother Baldov dared to stand up to them and ended up in St. Mungo's. I was simply at my wit's end. Mm. Thank you for Googling, Rachel. Uh, are the trigger sensitivity sensitivities adjustable? Yes, there's a, uh, an app that you can get from the Microsoft Store that's called Thrust Mapper. And then you can adjust the sensitivity for the stakes, for the um, shoulder buttons, or however you want to call this. So you, there's lots of customization you can do. You can also remap everything. So if you want to like change this, for example, so that A is up here, or this is X, or whatever, you could also re remap that. And also the buttons on the on the rear. Can you can do lots of that with the web uh, with the app. It looks like Harry Potter. That's because it's the same universe, Roblox. But it is not Harry Potter. The game is called Hogwarts Legacy. Hey, Akima. Nice. Me too. I don't want to run them out. I'm unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock's loyalists. Perhaps I can do something. I wanted to... 
Much Butter. as I would love to be rid of them, I wouldn't want you to risk injury or worse. Please be cautious. We should not have to live in fear. This is our home. Has the situation with Ranrock's loyalists now improved? The <laughs> I'm afraid not. I feel... Oh man, okay, you can't talk to her. I wanted to, I wanted to, like, barter with her. It doesn't look like it's, it's possible at the moment. It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my guard. Bardo Beaumont should have returned by now. Hype Psychom, I like it a lot. It's my second playthrough. I think that that <laughs> is a bit of an answer already as it is, right? Oh, there's another one. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip to the Ministry, hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine, Professor Fig. Okay. Okie dokie. This is what I wanted to do. Oh, man. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go back to... You know what? Maybe I've encountered some vaults that I could do. Vaults usually have some some stuff that you can just pick up. I should be easy enough. He's he's he says that a bit more interesting, I think, compared to the female character. Who lived here, I wonder? Like he says that a bit more curious, and she's she's she sounds so cute all the time. This looks intriguing. <laughs> rats <laughs> no <laughs> of course the one vault that I go to is the one that I can't open of course well there's a few dead Great. Mighty Avaras, hello! Thank you very much. Did you just yeet? <laughs> he just got yeeted in the air. Oh no, not another one! Oh, I need to learn a little more. I can't do crap. Abbas, thank you very much for the gifted sub to SZ Howell. <laughs> thank you very much. Hi, Nother Dreamer. Welcome. What is your all-time favorite game list? My favorite games are the Witcher games. The three Witcher games. I love them a lot. So my top my top three game series are um, the Witcher series, then the Last of Us series, and then the Resident Evil series. Man, I was really hoping I could get some coin this way. Well, okay, we need to go back up here, right? No, no, up here. Hi, Avaras. How are you doing? What is your favorite game? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Can you travel out of bounds? Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? What does that mean, out of bounds? I'm not a native English speaker, so... What, what does the phrase mean? I don't have a favorite game. I really like strategy and RPG games. Oh, can you name a few of your favorites in that category? Quali, Quali really likes strat strategy. I'm more the RPG kind of person. <laughs> Go outside the allocated area. Out of bounds, outside the map. No, no. Hope you're not here for a not grass sprig, because I'm not entirely sure I have them in stock. Mandrake. 
Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Maria can find another one of these uh these chests in the village, so I can get five hundred galleons. I've opened a few already, but I know there's definitely more. I opened this one already. Mm. Revelio. Oh, I can't go inside, but here's a little bit of coin. Thanks. Just like hunting for loot now. I open you. Do not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Rude and Peck said a customer. Haha, there you go. Okay, now we go back. I thought you could have got us in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, no, Father. No, no. <laughs> What do the fireworks on the map mean? There were fireworks on the map? Oh, here. Hmm, good question, actually. No idea. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Starcraft, Starcraft 2, Diablo 2, Diablo, Age of Mythology, Warcraft 2, Warcraft 1. You like all the crafts. <laughs> Dragon Age. Mm. Oh, I can't believe it. Can I well, believe it? What say we show you some of what's available? Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. Uh huh. I can tell you'll go far. Oh, I'll go far, Chet. I'll go far. It's Zonko Shop fireworks. Oh, oh, that makes sense. Yeah. More games, but I didn't want to spam the chat. It's fine. That gives me an impression, I think. Take a break time? Ah, break is soon. I'm gonna take a break soon. And then I'm gonna get a hot cocoa. So, no wait, uh... Acquire and use a mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously. So now basically what I gotta do is find a place where I can fight multiple enemies again. Where was the place that I just found? Wasn't wasn't it up here this one? With the uh, with the inferi, but maybe they're still dead now. I don't know. Yo, why is she says? Hey, Joe. Find a pack of. Do they? Would you call it a pack of spiders? I should investigate. Oh, that's the one in the in the Forbidden Forest. Where's the other one? Here. Oh man, but they're they're all dead now. Hmm. Multiple enemies. Does anybody remember if there's multiple enemies in this area? Something like, I don't know, mongrels. Or goblins would also work, right? Whoosh. Ooh. So we have a dueling here. That means... Isn't there another one? I could swear... Oh, there it is. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, right beneath me is a duel uh, is a is a place for dueling as well. Wish. A swarm? Is it a swarm of spiders? It sounds more like it. Nightmare, I believe, is the correct term. You don't like spiders, drags. <laughs> a web of spiders. Okay, acquire and use a mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously. Oh, level 15? Oh, 
Can you come together? Okay, wait. Uh, I need. You're not That was the wrong one. I was looking at this one. Oh my God, he's an animagus. Uh oh, that's gonna be difficult. Yeah, yeah, maybe level 15 is a bit like too much right now. <laughs> Man, I, I'm tipping down. It doesn't heal. Spider Man Den. <laughs> Gosh, that sounded creepy. Oh, you wait. What do you mean you cannot land on the roof? Wish. Oh, that was stupid. I would just heal, right? Ah, uh, toads. Dueling feats against who now? Mongrels, perfect. I need multiple of you. Are there multiple of you? Are you just all by yourself? Come on, I need multiple. Multiple enemies simultaneously. Did you just yeet himself into the air? <laughs> Did you see that? Yeet! Man. No. Where are the enemy groups when you need them? And when did I set my traps? I'm sure it's a big fire to kill a moon calf. A cluster of spooters? Must have been quite stately in its time. You can just use it, yeah, but I don't I don't wanna get myself into trouble for nothing. Also, they were also super far away from each other. I think the range from Mandrakes is not as as huge, right? So I need to have them very close to each other. Check minimap, you can see enemies there. Mm. Can you, really? Oh, the minimap, not the map map, okay. Infamous foe. What happened to the m medium bandit camp? I want a small one. Small, this one. Perfect. Hi, Strikey. Combat is so fast, I usually don't even have the time to read those challenge. Right, Turin? Yes. What range do we get with a broom? What do you mean? I find the rarest beasts in the forest, I do. You'll rally behind me. Akio. Okay. Bye. I've done it. Job done. Can move on with life. <laughs> Sneaky little kid just running into a group of deadly poachers and then you're like just mandraking them <laughs> and you're running away again like bye <laughs> see you next time <laughs> okay now um oh balloons oh man the textures weren't loading in were they wish wish Ta da Okay. Now we can just go back to Hogwarts, right? Just a prank, bro. It was just a prank hand. Oh my god. Um here. Hi totally Camille. Hello. I'm doing good. How are you doing? Welcome in. Transport time of how long you can go without refueling, recharging. Oh! Never ending. It goes on and on and on. Hi, Professor Garlic. Oh, 
God, this is so dangerous, though. Thank you. Okay, I think you're you wanted to teach me stuff. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. Hey Spencer. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Guardian Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. When executed correctly, Hi, Rosdy. you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Whoosh! She not like the ropes? People were complaining about the hair clipping and I like the ropes indeed a lot. Well done! Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. This one. Great. Wingardium Leviosa. Done and done. Thank you, Professor, for teaching me the ways of Vingardium Leviosa. <laughs> Nothing underneath? Ah. Okay. Hmm. I think... Was it up here? There was this other room where you could get lots of these Chinese chomping cabbages, right? Was it down here? Where I was with the Gryffindor boy? Oh, I looted everything already. Mm. Shame, really. Okay. Doesn't regrow. Hi, Joe. Welcome in. Hi, Rish. Good to see you. Hi, listen, lizards. Garlic. <laughs> Everybody loves some some garlic in their lives, right? Wow, well, we were... Okay, my friends, I see that Twitch will be running an ad in two minutes, so I'm gonna take a short break, uh, make myself a hot cocoa, and then I will return and we will continue. Um, like I said, I'll be running an ad now, so we don't have any interruptions during the actual gameplay, so everybody without a sub doesn't miss anything of the, the playing. And then, um, yeah, I will be running uh, the clip video for the Dead Space remake compilation that I made of your clips. Thank you very much for clipping, by the way. Okay, I see you in a few. Have fun. Content warning. Read before playing. Dead Space contains graphic violence, including explicit depiction of dismemberment. Nice. My favorite. Uh oh. Why do I hear the pounding? Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Oh my fucking god, Quali. <laughs> the moment to bring me a tea. <laughs> Just the bag jamming. <laughs> nice. more we done oh no we're not done <laughs> no ow ah, this game is so awesome wait i blew this guy up where's my loot pick a poo okay this scared me for a second okay what the <laughs> 
What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? It's so dark. Oh my god, this is the darkest game I've ever played. What the fuck? Mama. But you cannot take the t oh look at him he's so adorable though it's a he looks like chunky cool do i have that emote on my thingy my bobs here he looks like him he looks like chunky with a leather jacket why is he so adorable <laughs> can you buy this plushie somewhere how do you guys like the mid-air isaac twerk boop -a -doop, boop -boop -boop. Boop -doop, boop -boop -boop. My money don't jiggle jiggle. Is it no having snow snow over there? there is if I use the ADS cannons. Manual targeting like before. I can shoot it right off the hull. I got this. You Bruh. Oh god. <laughs> Quali best jump scare in the game. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> oh man, he's really good at that. She. <laughs> It became a baby. How does how does that work? Are we good? Are we safe? Is he dead? Are you dead? Oh my god. Okay, wait, I need to let off some steam. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sudden anger Such outburst. <laughs> Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Content warning. Read before playing. Dead Space contains graphic violence, including explicit depiction of dismemberment. Nice. My favorite. Uh oh. Why do I hear the pounding? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh my fucking god, Quali! <laughs> what the worst possible moment to bring me a tea? <laughs> Hi guys, I'm back with a hot cup of cocoa. Hi Aralia, welcome, how are you doing? Hi Trava, welcome. Good to see you, I'm late. I'm late to come into the classroom in Hey Lizards Legends. Hey Trava, good to see you, hello. I'm also, I guess, in your favorite area. I've seen you're also a fan of uh, of Professor Garlic. Me coming back to <laughs> nice. <laughs> Aw, poor kid. Thank you, thank you. Welcome back. Thank you, Aurelia. How you doing? I'd make a fine keeper with a bit more practice. Ah, oh, these ones. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Oh, sure. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. 
We shall see. I love plants, flowers, Don't and garlic. <laughs> I'll see what you did there. Solves the mystery. Um. Hmm. Over the riddle of the empty painting room. Oh, I have to. I have to look at it first, right? First at the painting, and then. Wish I could sneak into the other common room, just for an hour. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. What the hell was that sound? Man. Revelio. I was destined to be a glory. It's down here? I remember it was somewhere. This looks like the location uh -huh. of the painting. There you go. You Could come with let's me. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Little moth. As far as I can see. Avaraz, thank you very much for gifting us up to Malakatoni. Ha! <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. I hope that Malakatoni will enjoy the emos that I made in the ad for watching. Hello. Wait, you're here as well? Seems like m streamers know this. <laughs> really? The quality jump scare will never get old. No. Skellige wins. Hello. Good to see you. Hello. Looks very Lucius Malfoy. You think Lucius Malfoy? I was more thinking Geralt of Riga. He has a little scar over his eye, but he's a, he's a baby version of him, right? Have you ever seen the young Geralt of Rivia mod for Witcher 3? It looks very much like this. Very much so. And damn handsome, though. Le less kiddo-like. This one is very kiddo-like, but the... He, he looks more like mid-twenties in the mod. Like, mm, <laughs> not bad. <laughs> Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Treadmill stream. You hey, have a good workout, Aurelia. Hi, Edgy. I'm 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 great. I'm great. We're doing a second playthrough with a uh, relatively evil Slytherin, and I'm uh, first time. I'm gonna learn the yes. the evil curses, the the unforgivable unfor curses. Uh, I followed the clues. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. But pity I was so close to solving it. Who are you? You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is a meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. I've seen that. <laughs> Complete side of relationships quests. Ba -ba. The vo male voice actor is nice. Uh, you can change the pits. I, I made uh, the pitch. I, I made it a bit lower, but it sounds very robotic when you do that. Sadly, was it? Oh, there we go. Level up. Okay. Um, new spell set. Stupefy mastery. I want the revalue increasing. Evasion absorption. Blocking. Increase re range of revalue. Perfect. We're gonna get this one. Do you have new challenges that we've finished? Oh yeah, quite a bit actually. Oh, not not finished, but unlocked apparently. Okay, cool. Quests. Exploration. Ooh, and a broom skin. Night dance broom. Doesn't it actually look bad. Not too shabby, if I may say so. Uh, and capture the world, welcome in. Are you a photographer? Are you playing on Xbox Series X? No, I'm playing on PC. Does anything carry over to New Game Plus? Not that I could tell, no. I think there's no New Game Plus. I wish there was. Don't tell? What? <laughs> What's wrong? 
Oh, no. Quest, quest. Oops. Wrong tab. The face looks less emotionless on the male model than female to me. Really? Hmm. Madame Kogawa's assignment. Pop balloons over hog's meat. Pop balloons around the Quidditch pitch. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Let's let's do this. <laughs> Popping balloons is, is always good. Um This is actually the closest, huh? Damn. Okay. Uh, looking forward to Borgilis. I am. Oh, are you also having a Borgir tonight? Nice. Yeah, I do. Uh, just relatively evil. The evil meter is going down. Oh. <laughs> the textures are slowly loading in. You know what? I want to check out the the new broom design that I just got. Oh. Oh hell yeah. Amber dash. It's blue. I'm I'm not a Ravenclaw anymore. No, we have to we have to take this. This is unacceptable. Hi Chumpy, good to see you. Now I never know Abandoned when Chad cuts off out. the list. What? Finally, Chumpy is here. Hope you're well. Ah. <laughs> what do you mean? And never, Chad never cuts off list. I do do the photography. Nice. Your your name gave it away. <laughs> Juso, thank you very much for the gifted sub. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I was drifting a bit too much over there. Thank you very much, Juso, for the gifted sub. I appreciate you. I hope the person that got a sub will enjoy the emotes and the F for watching. Oh man, I remember there was one more. I think it was like somewhere over there and then... Yeah, there it is. Okay, now the next one over there. Hi Carl, welcome in. Has been a while. Hey, welcome back. There's a cold room for sale from the vendor outside Hawksmeat Station. Yeah, I don't have the coin right now. <laughs> I think it's like five thousand galleons. I don't have I don't have that coin. Hi Tadeus. Enjoy the emotes. Ah uh, hmm, I think I shall have Burgi as well today. A mushroom with Swiss and blue cheese. Ooh, sounds good. Can you pop balloons all day? Well, you will run out of balloons eventually, I think. Take from the Ravenclaw you played the Galleon. What? <laughs> oh, I see the balloons. Anybody else feel that the camera is turning so slowly on the How would when you, you like flank to controller? How would you like to flipendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Oh wow, I've just been in your class and she's already asking me to come back. Well, we were. I guess Professor Garlic can't get enough of me and my charm. Well, Damn it, we're the two lost around the Quidditch pitch. Hmm. Revelio. Oh, there it is. There the one that one is sneaky. Okay, and now. Is 
Is there Quidditch in the game? No, sadly not. I think every player was pretty bummed out about this. But who knows, maybe in the next game. In the, the sequel. Revelio. Scanning, scanning. Man, I can't find it. I don't see the, the last balloon. Yes, wife. Uh, I mean, Professor Garlic. Is the flight camera setting separate from the other camera settings? I don't think so. Oh, there it is. How did I miss that? I was right over there. Oh my god. Blind. Can Wait. you land on here? No. Oh man, why not? Oof. Can you attack from the room? No, you can't. Sadly. Turn to Madame Kugawa. Oh, summoner's cord, no. Whoosh. Sometimes it's a bit choppy, isn't it? How did you get on with those tasks? Wonderfully. Oh, come on. Give me some of that loot. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well... With those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Oh, Glacius. Pay attention to oh, no, your this is... wand work. I can't do this then, David, right? Because I need to do the certain quest with Mr. Mr. Moon. There's a sequel? I bet there's one planned. Crunchy. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. I shall do just that. Places. There you go. Catching on quickly. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Madam Kugawa. Hi, Sekra. Welcome in. How are you? Denied. <laughs> Professor Garlic assignment number two. She just can't get enough. Hey. She just can't get enough. Hey. Hey. Uh, wait. What is the assignment anyway? I, I always like professors, professor's assignment and then I'm rushing towards them and then... Mm. Okay, let's try. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Hi, Damien. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. Hi, Blue Summoner's Trick. Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? I'm in. Let's, let's try. Brilliant. I'm not really good at this, but let's try anyway. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Akio. My, uh, my wand slipped. Akio! Oh! Eh, lucky shot. Akio! Don't you dare knocking my off. Try to beat that. I shall try. I hate that they're in the middle of the of the view. It's so hard to see. Akio. That was one for the ages. Thanks. Akio. in the 
missed. Okay, let's try. Uh. Akio. Oh. <sighs> okay. I'll let you have that one. Well done. Thanks. You beat me. Hi Zelda, welcome in. Bit of good luck, that's all. Might might need to get that one slippage looked at. <laughs> of luck, that's all. That wasn't luck. I'm not lucky, I'm simply better than you. <laughs> Alright, fine. <laughs> you're right. You're better than me. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. The others. Thanks. I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Keep practicing. You're clearly not cut out for this. Wow, okay, we're evil, so... Leander, there's no easy way to say this. Well, actually, there is. You're not cut out for it. Well, you could have found a harder way to say it. <laughs> but perhaps you're right. I'll let the others know you're good enough for them. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Doom, thank you for the 20 month resub. What's wrong? What you gobbling about? Savage. Guys, I'm not enjoying this. I feel so uncomfortable being a nasty character, but I said I'm gonna be evil, and this is the first time ever in my life that I'm playing a character that is saying stuff like this. It really makes me uncomfortable, but I try. I tried to roleplay this whole thing. <laughs> That felt horrible, right? <laughs> so nasty. I feel so bad. <laughs> mm, quests? What else could we do? Professor Garlic assignment. Grow and harvest fluxweed. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. Do I have them? No. Oof. Okay, we're gonna travel to the room of requirement. Maybe I can grow some of it already? Or we just go to Hawksmeat already and try to um, buy the tomes that we can get, because some of these things you can just grow in medium and big pots, right? <clears throat> Liz's poor heart is breaking every single time she says something nasty. Yes. Come on, Liz. It must feel a little bit good being mean to these sassy summoners' court opponents. Sometimes a bit. I heard her. Welcome. Hogsmeade, here I come. Now I call everything I play Gobbin. <laughs> okay. This isn't comfortable being evil. No, I'm not. I could never. Like, I, I tried a few times playing Fable 2. And I could never stick to it. I always gave up and became a good character or started anew. Okay, let's see how much Hello coin I there. have. Come on in. Plenty to look at here. Hello. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Hi, Funkalo. Just discovering her in a rush why not. <laughs> okay, I have 400. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm broke as hell. A pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, I figure. So for flux, flux seed or what's called flux wheat, um, do I need a do I need a medium pot? This one. Are you going to play the new Wulong game? I don't know. Many ways of being evil. Yeah. Welcome, Ishivi. Hello. She's not evil, it's just real play. It would be evil if you were doing this in real life. I am totally not. I cannot be nasty on purpose. It's large. Oh, man. <sighs> so at this Let point, I just have to buy stuff, huh? I can do to help. Grow and harvest flux wheat. So I need to grow it. I need to acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. I simply don't have the coin for this. I guess I have to run around and explore some things. Revelio.
So I guess we're just running around and trying to... Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Nope. It does not. I remember that there was a... Was it here? That's not what I meant. <laughs> it was also good. Um, the moth thing. Wasn't the moth thing around here somewhere? I could swear there was a moth. A moth painting around here. Ah, oh, there it is. Ooh. Chest. <laughs> Lumos. I remember you. You took me forever. I was looking the wrong direction all the time. <laughs> hey, past or paste? Hi, paste. Um. Hey, Lolly, welcome. Revelio. Well, that's a big chest. But I figure I can't go inside, can I? Yeah, no. Ah, that's a massive lock. Okay, nice, nice. I'm just running in, stealing people's property. Don't mind me. Hmm. Come to the dark side with cookies. Oh, I love some cookies now. Oh, the music is so nice. Let's go. I am already welcome. Large can grow everything. Yeah, Rebellion. that's true. That is very true. Wait, I missed this. I need every coin that I can get. <laughs> or loot that I can then sell. First, we take a cupcake. Ambitious cloak. There's a painting by the harbor. Hmm. I actually, I think this is one of my m most favorite parts of playing this game. Running around and doing... Like, exploring and finding things. What, what is your guys' favorite about it? Oh, and the and the fighting mechanics. I really enjoy those. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Oh, look at that. Did you see that nice big chest? <laughs> also, this one here. Okay. Lumos. Um. Hi JV, welcome. Hi Apricats, hello. Liz and loot name a better combination. Liz singing while looting. <laughs> you can stop a thief uh, oh god, I lost my orientation now. Here? There it is. Think. Exploring on the bloom room. Merlin tried to give them if you have enough of them. Cupcake with one bite, just like a real snake. I think it was two bites. Like, like this. That was my demonstration of eating two bite cupcakes. Exploring as well. Not saying I don't the combat is amazing, it's very fun, right? I can't wait to learn the curses and see how they are performing in battle. I heard they're quite overpowered. But since I'm not doing much exploring in this playthrough, I will uh, focus on... Uh, and I'm, I'm focusing on the main quest, that's why I won't have all the skill points, I, I guess. I believe you are ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in mid-air. Simply complete a few tasks, and then come and see me. 
Pff, grow and harvest flux weed. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. So I guess I go to the tomes guy first and then buy the bigger the bigger um, tables so I can make flux weed. And then I have to somehow acquire the other plants and then use them. Her waist is so tiny. Who's? Here I come. Nice big chest. Yes, yes. Hot top. Woohoo. Thank you, not a dreamer. Endless says that she has difficulty being nasty. Yeah, I, I really, I really, meh. Mm. I don't know if you guys ever played Fable, but I, I could never do it. I never got far in the story of being evil. It was like, uh, evil. I was always like, oh no, this has to stop. So I should have maybe Take enough. Your time looking about. Plenty of wonderful books to stoke a curious mind. Uh huh. Uh huh. I also have some new gear. Let's check it out. Maybe it's better than what I have. Oh hell yes! <laughs> those, those heads though. Are you better? Nope. Okay. So this can be sold. Let's look at what we have, shall we? <laughs> as sweet as we have a we have a command for this. So potting table with three medium pot. Oh god, this is so expensive. Potting table with one medium pot spellcraft. Is there one with large? Oh, too large. With a large pot spellcraft. So I'm gonna get this one, right? I love Fable. Have you played all three of them? I think my quest is glitched. Oh no, gotcha, which one? <laughs> that was epic. Why don't you grow in herbology class? Don't I have just one little little pot in there? Can I have multiple pots in the herbology classroom? The only game that did evil properly was Mass Effect 1. The renegade options were evil in the sense that it'd be breaking the law, cheating and scheming, but all in your favor for humanity. Hmm. Hmm. Lots of love for the big chest today, yes. Nice game in the future where we'll get a new game. Yes, I'm looking forward to that. I have to say I'm positively surprised by the variations in the mini games. The Merlin trials are always a bit different. A bit, yeah, a bit. You can get pretty evil in Baldur's Gate too. You can have seven at safe at the safe room. Yeah, but uh, I have a I have a money issue. <laughs> I have a money issue because I want to focus on the main quest. Maybe I need to do some side quests to actually get some coin, huh? So, legit question. Can I really grow? Do I have all pot sizes available in, in, the, po in, in the classroom of, of garlic? In the greenhouse. Could I just always go to the greenhouse and and grow every size plant there? No, okay. Why are you in a hot tub? Because it was redeemed, I have a channel point redemption where people can put me in a hot tub. It's very popular. <laughs> Only small no class, so I need this. Okay, I'm gonna go with this one. Nothing like finding just the right thing. Uh huh. Yeah. And I guess now I'm gonna go to Pippin, because he said if you ever need some coin, so I'm gonna go there and I will. Was it this one? Yeah. Do the side quests and sell all the loot. Opens the big chest along the way. Hey, I, I, DK, I played this game already. I have like hundreds, of, 100 hours in this game and I played a very thorough playthrough, my first playthrough. The issue is I, my plan 
was to do a game where I focus on the main quest, which I can't do. I can't focus on the main quest if I if I have to do these things and it's locked behind like coin. I we need have to buy a young items. Student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery. Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. I sometimes Here are the don't know. Invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully, she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. At this point, if I would have said she sounds annoying, would I have said no to the quest that way? Or do you never say no to quests in this game? I don't know how, how it works. Three invisibility potions. Do I have to make them or did he give them to me? Okay, I have them now. Good. Dun, 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 dun. Hi, Miss Bleachy. Welcome in. Um, do I have a fast travel point close by? Uh, world map. Oh, hell no. I haven't been far. <laughs> wow. I think you have it have no medium size also being able to grow only one plant is a bit cumbersome that's true but i don't have the coin at the moment so hmm. Hmm. seems a pleasant enough little place the game definitely pushes you into side quests to keep the money flowing yeah it's a bit it's a bit sad that you have to do it to um to be able to continue with the main quest my plan was to focus on main quest and everything that is uh, Slytherin House exclusive, you know. So yeah, by the way, guys, if you're certain there's something that you can only do as a Slytherin, feel free to tell me. If I'm not careful. So I can do the quest myself. You have any performance issues on PC? Hi, welcome in. Not really. Sometimes it's dropping frames in certain areas, but not like super bad. Although I have a very good PC, but still uh, Hogsmeade and Hogwarts is always challenging for some reason. But I do play on ultra graphics without um, ray tracing though. You fixed the hair? No, I didn't fix the hair. I took off the, I took off the, the clothes, the, the, the robe. Hi, Professor Random. Welcome back. That Pippin should have been here by now. Pet nasty Pippin. Madam Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have you brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Drink it. Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. Okay. Drink an invisibility potion. seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, hmm. <laughs> I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? 
not a chance. That ne'er-do-well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Okay. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. What do you have for sale? What uh, are we looking for today? And are you buying my stuff? This will do just fine. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. I didn't have problem with money and I pretty much focused on the main quest. I think what might be the issue is that I'm doing these um, challenge, the, those, those assignments, because I want Rebellion. to have... Because I want to have the um, all the all the spells. Did you unlock all the spells? Could it be a Merlin trial? Well, where we were. Hi, Sophia. Welcome. Give me some nuts. Oh, no chest. Okay. Hi, Hartson. There's one spot that still eludes me. Ah, and don't get me started on the landing platforms. Uh, Hartson, what I did was I, I was zooming out and then you can see per area. So maybe maybe that will help you. You could go like this, and then you would see how how many balloons you have in that area, how many landing plot um, spots you have in that area. That helps a lot to like limit the area that I, that you have to search. And then, duh! Thank you, Liz. You're welcome. <laughs> and if if that doesn't help, there's online guides. I bet that you could use. Um mm. Interesting how even that different. My MC posture and persona seems different to to me than female. Yeah. I like I think I like the the guy a bit better. Oh, there's a dragon on my mini map. Why? Cool. So now we just go back to... So this is probably considered a... Is that a, considered a, sci a side quest? Or are the assignments mandatory? Because I want to have all the spells. Hogs meet here, I come. I wish it was cross safe and not needed to rebuy. Oh yeah. One hundred hours and then I never zoomed out that much to the map. No, zooks. <laughs> well, it was pretty much at the end of my playthrough that I figured out that you can skip between the three maps, the Hawksmead, Hogwarts, and the world map, by to a certain point in the story, by just going left and right on the deep hat. That took me a while as well. Hello there. In the market for potions, are we? Never thought of that mis myself. I'm a <laughs> too far. <laughs> no, it's fine. Sometimes things are just like so simple that it's like too simple to think of. You know what I mean? I delivered the, the potions follows. to Fatima Luang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? Well, I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do what? truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Delivering those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well, I shall increase your pay, but I'm not at all pleased about it. Best of luck with your potions, Mr. Pippin. Do take care. <laughs> Nobody will like me. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hey Lau, welcome in. Good morning. Hi Slyrak. Okay, 500 coin. Very good, very nice. Practice flying near the spires. Practice flying near Cambridge. Okay, this is easy, but grow and harvest flux weed and acquire all three combat plans and use them simultaneously. I think I'm gonna try this and I'm gonna go to the map chamber first to to see if I can um do it in my room of requirement. That didn't sound evil at all. You think so? Hi Zor, welcome. Cantankerous? Wow, that's harsh. What does that mean? I've never heard that word before. When we ask a race, the boss will hate us. Hmm, well, not my problem. <laughs> so, do I already have a potting area? Da -da 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 -da. So, flux weed. So I need to buy this first. Quite all three combat plants. Herbology. No, wait. That's a small one. Need the big one, right? this Hey, thank you for the 8-month resub! Hi, Liz Vau. A second playthrough so soon. Still trying to finish my first. Have fun. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoy your... your first playthrough. Actually, I want to check something. And thank you very much for the... Thank you very much for the resub. How does the green look? Oh, green might not be too bad after all, right? Maybe we should go all Slytherin. Okay, so now, um, now I need to get the the seeds to grow the stuff, right? Pfft, lots of running around for this. <laughs> I think I need to go here. Um, if I found it, I should have asked for the money too. It seems all roads how much? To how much do you usually get for this? Juso, I didn't. How did I? Was I so into the game that I completely missed out? Juso, thank you so much for the two thousand bits. Getting closer to filling the first goal for today. Thank you so much, Juso. I appreciate you. Greetings. Please Thank you. Take your time looking about. Thank you very much. Flux sweet. Now you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Not grass. I think I never used that. Thank you so much. And no Krill, hi! Happy Friday as well. Thank you so much for the for the reset for two months. Welcome back. So if I want to get the mandrakes, I need to go up that hill, right? Hi, Ilaria. Welcome in. Liz working on a meth lab. Hey, don't tell anybody. This is between us. Hi, Krill. How you doing? Oh, stuck. The second playthrough doesn't keep the previous progress. No. Nope. Have a look around. I'll be with you in just a minute. <sighs> 
2,450 galleons. <laughs> I guess we gotta do some Doors more side quests. Open. You be sure to stop by soon. Guess we're doing some more side quests, my friends. <laughs> First, we can do this. This should be close by, and then we do some more exploring, get some coin. Follow the butterflies. Talk to Clementine Willardsey. Um, world map. Hi, mutant. Welcome in. All this way. Sheesh. Okay. Hi, nerd buff. Welcome in. Cantankerous, that is me at 5 a.m. when I start work. Still haven't figured out what it means. Green, Professor Garlic also green. Is this destiny? Match it's made like in a heaven. Right out of a storybook. Well, it is a place right out of a storybook, isn't it? Hi, Psionic, welcome in. Does anyone have a spare spine? No, I I need my own. I'm sorry, Shen. Do you have something to sell? No, not really. I mean, one piece of clothing, but like, what is that? Sixty bucks? It's not gonna help, is it? I'm not. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do it like this. There we go. Level up! Whee! Let's go! Okay. Wow, this is far. Okay, let's see. Where's my character looking down the entire time? Sheesh. If anyone from Dev Team is watching, please fix the biscuit mission. What is the biscuit mission? <laughs> Biscuit mission. I don't I don't think I've ever heard of a biscuit mission. Or maybe I'm just bad tempered, argumentative, and uncooperative. Oh cantankerous, okay. Thank you very much, Drex. Good morning, Chris. How are you? Happy Friday. I wish you can fly like this in Elden Ring, really. You rescue bees. Oh, biscuit! The end. Oh, the bees biscuit. Now I remember. That wasn't broken for me. What was wrong with it for you? Sugar bear. Hello. How are you? Hey, listen, friends. Hi, Ratty Petty. Welcome in. Good morning, you guys. Turn to Madame Kugawa. Let's go. So that's the nope. Hogwarts map. Here, right? I'm well, just a little tired. Oh no! I hope you had you. Did you have a coffee yet? Do you drink coffee? Maybe that helps. High picture. Well, sometimes I feel very uncomfortable telling people off and be like, yeah, you know you really suck at this. <laughs> Man, this feels so nasty. Welcome back. Have you finished your assignments? I have. Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our resto momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop Quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Aresto momento. 
<laughs> Hi, Squirrelly. Welcome. Oh, Ewoks are so cute. Hi, Sono. Hello. Very good. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Perhaps before you leave here. Da -da -da. Arrest the momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Where did the other book go? Ah. There it is. Ah. Well done. You are on your way to mastering Arresto Momentum. Mm-hmm. And now I'm on my way out of your classroom or whatever it is. <laughs> Office. Okay. So that we have done. I can't believe I opened the Hogwarts Legacy World is right. I think it's great, really. I remember how I was running through Hogwarts and I was like, oh nice, this is so much to explore. And then I zoomed out. I was like, what? <laughs> All of this? What's your favorite side quest in this game, chat? Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to go in my room of requirement and grow the flux weed. I should be able to do this now. Right? Also now I have glaciers, right? I could do this. I don't know if David is still here. Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you brewed. Deke, you're making a mess. Well done. Take things. You should, should be, be proud, proud of, of all, all the potions, potions you've brewed. Fifteen minutes. Are you kidding me? Okay. Um. Okay, so this is this is already in the making at least. Hi, Zero Stick. Good morning. How are you doing? Good to see you. Hello. Hmm. I don't like these half like knee long. Uh, robes. I really don't like them. I think they look weird. What's this? Ooh, house fanatic school robe. <laughs> yeah, but still, I don't like... I don't like how it's cut off like this. I like the long ones. I think they look cooler. But I think w with this, we need to get a haircut. Badly. If I can afford one, that is. Hi, Edgy Wizard. Anyone else get a really annoyed with the flu lady? There is a beautiful mod that is very easy to install. It's called Silencio. Neat, here I come. And I have it installed, and that's why you don't hear her talking now. Silence. Beautiful, isn't it? I was really annoyed at her, too. <laughs> and the m second that I heard that there is a worrying far mod. too much nobody's looking at you look at that boy why did you buy me a second pair i hate these socks. Novelty socks at that price socks, can't be so if you're Peter Smelly, wait you'll have oh, yeah. i'd rather have no yourself. socks than be dancing like this you're not dancing you're exercising father why is he dancing what are they talking about i went to the wrong shop whoops whoopsie poopins oh, to the hello. tea sipping lady and how would one like to be styled today hello Oh, come in! Come in! Welcome to Madame Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly! Why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the Ministry and I'm here thriving. <laughs> Absolutely thriving. <laughs> but look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Wow. Looking for a change, are we? Wow, rude. 
I thought you would read your character name as a swear word. Oh yeah, that's intended. I I I like the swear word. I use it all the time of play. <clears throat> Sorry, I played lots of uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, so that's literally burned into my brain. Why not, I say? What sort of change? Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Yeah, thank Why God. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. How many playthroughs have you done? One. What services do you offer? What is it you might be interested in? This is definitely the, the Eddie Redmayne um, hair, right? The... Fantastic beasts and where to find them here. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> I like this one too. Which hair do we take? Chat, I can't pick. Oh, this is the same as Sebastian, right? That's cool. <laughs> Sheesh. Hmm. This one is pretty nice. Hi, Death Riven, by the way. Hi, Razor. Are you a fan? No. The new dear. Hi, Brad. Welcome. Get the British politician hairstyle. I don't know. It doesn't it doesn't say anywhere? But is it is it this one? <laughs> I unlocked forty three out of forty five achievements. Sheesh. I think I, I, I think I kind of like this one. I think that goes well with him. Fantastic Beast style. This one? I think it doesn't really go well with his face. So this one or maybe something like this. You know, I'm going. For, I want to go for something that looks like a bit of a noble. You know, like a like a snob schnickel Fritz. Is also not too bad. I like the fantastic. Um, I like this one as well, but I think it doesn't really look that well with his face. Oh my god, I'm too. I really like this one. Let's take this one. You take care now, and I shall hope to see you soon. Aye, ma'am. Now we have no more clipping with our thingy here, with our, what's it called? Cloak. Something arrogant, yeah. Well, I think he just has it in his face, right? Well, now he just looks cutesy and stuff, but sometimes he really looks like Okay, side quest, let's go. A bald. <laughs> Pulling a, a Voldemort, are we? Hey, Vent Skywalker, hello. Thank you for the two month resub. Hello, how goes it on the magic path? It's going very well. How are you doing? Thank you very much for the two month subscription. I hope you're doing good. And thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome. Breaking camp. Okay, let's get some action, my friends. Level two. That should be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh, 
Oh, uh, this seems to be close enough. Arrogant chic, exactly. Stretch, Avi, good idea. Thank you very much. Everybody, if you're sitting as long as I do, maybe you also want to take a stretch. Oh. Nice. Thank you very much. Have I been? Yeah, I've been here before. Who lives here? People. People live here. Hi, Sir Kid. Good morning. You look cozy. Yeah, that's me and my my hoodie. It always looks kind of cozy. One human to worry about. <clears throat> well, I wouldn't give for a cup of mushroom tea. Okay, so my favorite is this, and then we have this. Perfect. And then, um, yeah. <laughs> 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 Oh, yes. I won't rest. Such arrogance. Not quiet. How nice of you. Expelliarmus. Coming here. Oh. Oh yes. Expelli I will make you pay. <laughs> Too late for you to learn the error of your ways. Yes. One camp down, one more to go. Sarkin, thank you very much for the 11 month resub of Prime. And then, oh my god, April, thank you very much for the first time subscription ever on my channel. Both of you enjoy the emotes and the ad free watching. And welcome to the Chonkies for the first time, April. Welcome in. Thank you very much for picking me as your prime Rebellion. target for the month. Hmm, I was hoping for a little bit of more loot, but okay. Bags, brate, dachalo. I've been looking for like three hours now, and I love it here. Ferdy, thank you so much. Welcome in. Hi, Fats. Hello, welcome. One less human to worry about. Expelliarmus. <laughs> Didn't that work? Always on the game. Oh. oh man! What an unfortunate disappointment! No! That was When you're too far away, doesn't it work? Oh shit. No, the wrong that was the wrong guy. Confringo. Are you used to red spell? 
I was just so confused. Alan Beaumont will be glad to hear that. I was just so confused because I was constantly trying to use certain spells with certain effects and then like, for example, Expelliarmus, equipping, unequipping stuff from them, like just arming them and then shooting things at them again, like their own weapons. And it, so often it didn't work and I was like trying to figure it out. And then I'm distracted from actual fighting and like dodging. Uh, I just found you through Hogwarts, loving watching so Thank you so much, April. Thank you. Hope you're doing love. Hope you're doing lovely. I am, Bex. How are you doing? Return to Claire Beaumont. Very French. Beaumont. La da 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 da. Grinding the new forest game achievements now, so I needed to watch something, but I got me by the neck. It was very entertaining here. Oh man, I loved um I was I was also just playing Sons of the Forest. Such a good game. I I'm very excited to see what they're gonna do, Ferdy. I do miss the bustle of business. Hello, Madame Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? Sad dying sons. You won't get away with that list, watch me. <laughs> it was the view. I surprised them. I managed to catch them off guard. When my brother returns, this news will mean the world to him. You saved our Hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other Hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. May I see your wares? What do you have for sale? What are you looking for exactly? Thank you. Sincerely. Hey, Barty. Thank you very much. Welcome in. How are you doing? Oh, that's better than what I have. Whoops. Okay. Thank you for passing through. Hey, it makes you cry. Hello. How are you doing? Good to see you. Thanks for the reset for 12 months, an entire year. Well, well, we were. I hope you're doing good. Makes you cry. Thanks for the support. Was it here? Oh my god. <laughs> Um Yeah, really good game. Need those new updates now. Um did you already play with the with the tool belt thingy mobs where you can have hotkeys for weapons and just like click one for this weapon, click two for this weapon and then you changes the the equipment? Uh lizard eye glasses. Oh, nah. <laughs> okay, next quest. Ghost of our love. Oh, cross. <laughs> Ghost of our love. <laughs> Shouldn't be too difficult. I'd managed to do it once. I <laughs> should be able to do it again. It was relatively close to. Uh, the ho hawk's meat, right? No, it was the. It was the forbidden forest. Here? Them glasses would be Luna's if she was a Slytherin, yeah, true. Cannot key anything from start, right? No. But what do you mean? You couldn't do that before, now you can. Meetings are starting up. No, no, sugar bear. I hope you have, I hope it's gonna be nice and easy. Lumos. So there you are. Candles. There you go. Wonder where they're heading. <laughs> Super eerie and mysterious, and then suddenly. The candles seem to be leading into the forbidden forest. Ah, yeah, nice. <laughs> Such a mood killer. Hey, don't go so fast. No, no, Dark Bog, you didn't see me. Oh. 
Yay! Man, these candles. The treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic in the Forbidden Forest could... Treasure hunting suits me. Whoa, we Reminded me of the TikTok you sent me, Liz, the floating candles. Right, so pretty. I saw a video uh, on, on TikTok and there was a lady and she got... She's a Harry Potter fan and she got... Um, a lamp that is just a set of floating candles basically they're they're stripped on those those little threads that are like see-through kind of and very thin and then you can hang it up and they are in different on different heights and the light switch to turn it on or the remote is a wand so you flick it at it and then the lights go on it's so pretty i would love to have it here hanging here in the background or so that would be so cool Oops. Lumos. Chocolate coffee? Mocha. Make those trumpet plants a soundbite for stream. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> that sounds awesome. It's very, very pretty. I bet you could look it up. Um, bloop. I'm tempted about just buying them, but I think this is not the way. I want to be able to uh, grow them myself and then I can use them when I need them to. Talk to Luke and we could try to do this now, but I literally hate the crossed ones. Round three. Ugh, it's the worst. Professor Garlic assignment. I want to learn flip handle before I go. <laughs> where where can I buy the things again? The the plants. Hawks meat and then up here, right? Also, I need to go into this uh, room that I showed you, David. I told you, but I've never been there myself. I would always hang out beside that flower. So cute. Beep, Does beep, it get beep. any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Nope. Just not. I don't understand why they had... Um, I don't understand why they had the flying in Hogwarts area available, but then in Hogsmeade it's forbidden. Doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, Hogsmeade is even smaller than Hogwarts, so why not? Hey, hope you're not here for a not grass sprig, because I'm not entirely sure I have them in stock. Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Hey, Captain Redbeard, hello. Things will be safe with me until they're sold. Then you'll have to make do with money. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. 2,000. Let's say I need 2,000 more. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Maybe I should just run around through Hogwarts and try to find all the eye, eye chests. Imagine you wake up after bad nights and walk past your garden and hear that plant and the plants making that sound. Quite cheerful, yes. Hmm. HOA deemed flying hazardous to health. Hmm. So the flux switch should be done already. The growing part. I need to harvest it too. Rebellion. I saw what you did. Ha! I have no tolerance for thieves. Hand them back. Hand what back, sir? We've not took a thing. Hand them back. There's nothing to give, sir. It was only the one. How 
many times. Are you pair going to keep pilfering my shop? I swear it was just those ones, sir. Promise, sir. We'd never take more than those. I tell you this, they'll not appreciate your antics in Azkaban. You just wait till I see your mother. That was a bit harsh. That was a bit harsh. Seems like they have been Rebellion. pestering him for quite some time. Oh man, that was loud. Liz, did you play Forbidden West? Yes. I didn't stream much of it. Gosh, this, the the bring is so loud in here. Rebellion. Okay, this seems to be outside of here. It's a thing outside the U. Isn't a thing outside the USA? Yeah. Okay. I'm I'm in Europe. I have no idea. <laughs> Hi, uh, Devil Hazard. Browsing for mods and found a playable Yennefer mod. For this game? Rebellion. I mean, you could easily make your own Yennefer. There's purple eyes, there's black hair, there's curls. So I think you could easily make a Yennefer. The biggest issue is the face shape, I guess. Aha, uh -huh, this is exactly what I need. Can I go into hiding right in front of it and then I can still... No, it's still like, I see you. <laughs> oh. Gotcha. Hello there. Ready for a little change in fashion, are we? Plenty to choose from here, so take your time. <laughs> this is allowed. Hey, Redwell, welcome. Um... Hmm. Somehow my... My cursor was borked there. I wanted to go to gear. There you are. Did I get anything new? No. Forbidden West DLC also coming this April. Mm hmm. Okay. I think Forbidden West was pretty cool, but it was very grindy. Uh, same was going for Zero Dawn. I felt it was very grindy if you were playing on higher difficulties. And I was... You know... Mm, <laughs> I'm not a fan of grind. So I, f I finished... Um, I started Horizon Forbidden West. Off stream. And... Um, I lowered the difficulty so I could... I could just like literally go for main quest and ignore everything else and I don't have to farm and 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 literally I also I also ignored many of the features that the game had like for upgrading your gear and stuff it's literally just main story putting on whatever looked good done <laughs> were you on the highest difficulty yeah I, s I played Horizon Zero Dawn on my first playthrough on ultra, ultra hard, and then I did the same, the hardest difficulty they offered in Forbidden West when it came out. And then I tried the custom difficulty thing, but even that was pff, still super grindy. Mm, hi Panda, welcome. Hi Dweebs, thank you. Thank you for being here. Ah, man, I, uh, I'm a bit lost with what to do now. The the dungeons or like the vaults that I found they don't have anything that I could do really. I could try to go to the hamlets maybe and and try to open chests and get coin there. 
Thank you very much for the follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. Hi, Amelie. Hello. Hi, Nick. I felt Horizon, Zero Horizon 1 was better than Horizon 2 so much. I didn't even finish it. Yeah, I didn't finish it for a very long time either. Oh, it's bad boys. Oh, well. Pull yourself together. I can't be going about like this. Hogwarts is very lucky they've got protection. Oh, I can't use pro I can't use the Petrificus Totalus yet, right? Oh, it's an Animagus. Ooh, okay. Oh well, we come we come back later for this maybe. Crunchy pistachio. Oh, I love pistachios and pistachio ice cream. Mm, so good. Thank you very much for the first time sub with Prime. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. Welcome to the These Chonkies. Rocks have seen better days. Guys, welcome a first time subscriber, please, with lots of chonky chonks, Chen. I hope you're doing good, Panda. Hi, cat lady. Howdy. Uh, does each house have a different storyline? Um, there's differences, but I think they're very minor. As far as I can tell. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Find it out. Move in. Revelio. Okay, we're literally going through people's houses to get coin now. <laughs> feel a bit bad. Just a smidge. Oh, this is the place that has a duck box right in front of, uh, right in, living in the, in the area, right? Revelio. Do, 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 do. Hi, Agreg. Hi, Sea Power. Am I surrounded? I get the battle music. I see lots of arrows on my mini map. This is sus. Hmm. I'm all about the loot, about the loot, no trouble. Oh, there's a Merlin trial up here. Rebellion. This is probably locked, right? Oh, maybe not. Hello. <laughs> Just waltzing into people's homes. Hello, I'm here for the loot. <laughs> How did you learn to make emotes? I've always been drawing a little bit here and there, and uh, I've always been interested in drawing. And also always liked singing. And always loved video games, so streaming was pretty much a good place to put all my interests, interests together. I wish you could buy a house or a vault at Green Gods to store your stuff. Ooh, not a bad idea, yeah. This is a loot goblin, this is true. This is well known. <laughs> hey, let me just rob your house, I'll be right out of here. <laughs> um, Endira Wolf. Let's see if I looted every anything that is uh, worth putting on. Yes, indeed. Okay. Whoops. Ooh. It's not too bad. But I still prefer this. Oh. That's a downgrade. Okay, let's sell. I wish they had a set for clothes that you have equipped and then a separate one clothes like visually so that if you change the gear that you have with the bonuses and everything and the defense and offense um, that it wouldn't change the look that you have. So you don't have to constantly go back and change that. You know what I mean? Hello, do you have a moment? Yes, but just the one I'm afraid. Running the shop keeps me rather busy. I'm the new proprietor. Indira Wolf? Okay. What do you have for sale? Nope. <laughs> Get out of here. Do you know what you might be looking for? I'm looking for money. Exactly. 
exactly what I needed. Thank you. Perfect. How convenient. What's this? Unicorn hell. Okay. Thank you for your business. Hope you'll come and see me again. Hi, Kira. Uh, you could just check out my YouTube channel. I have three different ones, but one of them has song covers. Uh, this would be this one here. The channel there, the TTV Liz one. And my most recent cover that I uploaded there was the Blood Upon the Snow, originally sung by Jose Yee. Um, and uh, the end song that you hear when you've finished God of War Ragnarok. There's a chest over there, but I think this one I can't open without a little more, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Rebellion. And that is that. There's some spooters over here. Parkour. Bonk. These little buggers, man. Hey, purple. <laughs> that is a joke, yeah. Incendio. So is it is it ironic you don't like the playthrough of Hogwarts? Cotton grass. Do I have? Oh yeah. Okay, I have my favorite combo. Damn it! What? Why didn't that work? Why did that not work? <laughs> Come on, use your tongue. Ow. It's quite nasty, isn't it? Oh, and you subscribed as well. Thank you for the two month resub. Purple, thank you very, very much. Welcome back to the Welcome back to the chonkies. Enjoy the emotes. How many main story missions have you done so far? Uh, I think I can see that in the in the challenges, right? If I'm not mistaken, quests, assignments, main quests. So two, six, twelve, fifteen, fifteen main quests. I think, if I understand this correct. Hi luck now, welcome. It's always the tongue, yeah. I mean, that's pretty nasty, isn't it? But I kind of like the fighting there. It's, it's one of my favorite combos to do. Let's fly over there. Let's let's do some main quest. I wanted to learn Flipendo before, but I have a feeling this is gonna take forever. And I'm um, I'm a bit bored of running back and forth with uh, with learning the uh, acquiring all the plant stuff. Wish. Over here. Just an octo bokdo. What is that? Hi, Professor Fig. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. 
They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Okay. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. Okay. No sense in announcing our arrival. Okay. Oh, wait. Before we engage into fighting, do I have in, in, any talents? Oh, yeah. I have one. Okay, cool. Okay. This would be nice. But how about... Mm. New spell set. Yeah, that's it. That's the one. That's the one that I'm gonna use. God, which one did I always have? I think this one was always my, um... My troll one. Hi Marta, welcome. Oh, it's a uh, from Jedi Fallen Order. It's a um, it's a Quickly boss there. Now. Reaching an enemy undetected allows you to cast Petrificus Totalus. This will permanently incapacitate incapacitate a weaker enemy or significantly damage a stronger one. Okay, can I do it? Can I do it? Can I do it? I really like the Petrificus Totalus one. It's a bit weird that it kind of counts as a kill, Stay right? Stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalus. Totalus. Well done. Revelio. There's quite a few of them over there. Uh, there must be something here. Ramrock said so. Petrificus Totalus. Ramrock said so. I love the sneaky sneaks. Revenue. Okay, I see four more. Petrificus Totalus doing here. This patrol is worth it. Uh, there must be something here. Ramrock said so. Oh, that was close. Ow. Okay, I think maybe we can take these out to together. Who's there? Why am I? Maybe not. Maybe I need to improve the range of my Petrificus to Talos or something like this. Orders Search the tower. Directly from Ranrock. These orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? Hey Paul. And why here? Hi, giants. Um, hi, Vampro. Welcome. Search the tower in the surrounding area. Look for anything to do with the names. What you find here could be the key to goblin kind finally taking its rightful place in the world, Renrock. Why did I... Why did I have to unhide? Many goblins have always been antagonistic towards wizard kind. Revelio, this is different somehow. Pretty oh, nasty. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's get inside. Looks Where can you like learn Avada? That's a side quest. With Sebastian, it's so you locked. have to do the Sebastian quest. Teach me, said Pike. An unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. Okay. I wonder who this is. With robes like that, it could be anyone. 
Looks like a very classic um, sorcerer, right? Like a very classic wizard. Kind of cliche. Pointy head, staff, long cloak. <laughs> Panda, the hello, hello, how are you, my friend? Good to see you. How is it going today? Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Oh, there he is. Hello. Oh, I can't open this. I think we need a ban there. <laughs> Thank on Steve. Thank you very much. <laughs> wow, well, we are dark spirits. Sheesh. Hello, Professor. Did you say Sam Bacar's tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Commanded to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, be careful. I will, sir. I'll see you back in the map chamber. Okay. Thunderbolts and lightning, very, very frightening. A reservoir of ancient magic, downstairs near the entry. Um, just popping in to say hey. Wasn't quality stream for a bit figured I'd say hey before I resume to my morning. Yes, you do that. What's on the menu today for for the day? That was a tall mushroom. <laughs> We had quite a few of those uh, people coming in, showing me how excited they are to see me. If you know what I mean. Not that kind of wand. I think that- is that not a magic wand <laughs> that I saw in chat? The first trial, let's go. Hi, Invisible Clown, welcome. Hi, Only. Hi, App, welcome, how are you doing? Hi, I'm a place, hello. Chore safety, meeting with work, walk the dog. <gasps> Doggle! Breakfast. In that order? Shouldn't you have breakfast a bit earlier? Less artwork wasted on mods. <laughs> I've seen this before, in Gringotts and the Restricted section. No loot? Okay, I was just checking. Wow, I think I still think that these designs for these areas are so pretty. Oh, oh dear. I remember this. <laughs> I might be a bit too sleepy for this today. Impressive. Yep. That must have done something. Best have a look around. Okay, just checking. Whoosh. Whoosh. Hmm. Oh man, this is so trippy. Oh dear. Oh god. Oh no, I don't like this. Ah! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> I 
Any loot in the corners? Um, before I activate it, there's a chest. Hello. All traces of ancient magic. Something Poof. must be different. Poof. Poof. Wait. I think I'm confusing this with another trial. None of you shall come to life. Wait, that's how we're supposed to show you, Liz? I d did it wrong the whole two years. <laughs> oh dear. That's fine the way you do it, Strobel. It's fine. <laughs> These are never a welcome sight. At least I know Actually. what to expect this time. I will take my leave now. Take care, Liz. You too. Expelliarmus. Bolt. Expelliarmus. Oh man. Nice. Thanks to the follows, everybody. Welcome. Oh yeah, here we go. I don't remember which one was progress. There we uh, we have this what room. What the keepers planned for me? There's this room and then there's the other room. I don't know which one is extra loot content and which one is the actual main goal. But I have a These feeling. These look familiar. Akio. Maybe this was the room for more... For more... Oh, uh, loot. Diablo 3 vibes. Ooh, I've never played Diablo 3. I just played uh, 2 Resurrected. Hi, Scorpius. Welcome. <clears throat> hey, why the statue hate? Because they tend to come to life and then smack you. Akio. What happens if I go through the gate? This is locked off if I go through there. So statues. Hmm. Good oh. oh. Ouch. Good Bonk. <laughs> Not making this easy on me. Ah, it's fine. We can manage, right? So there was this er other... Oh. I wanted to say there was this other area that I haven't checked out and now we're sealed off. Okay, anyways. Hi, 
I'm Managa. Hi, welcome in. Okay, let's run up. This is fine. Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. Uh huh. Dito, hello, my friend. Thank you for the 28 month resub. I hope you're doing good. Schluckschnecken. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. That's from the second movie? Right? Yeah, that's from the second movie. Nice. <laughs> How are you doing, Dito? Lamprino, thank you for the gift of sub to Murata. What did that burst of magic change on both sides of the archway? Something must be different. Hi, Will Master. Welcome. Kapow! Gerald got a haircut. Hey, yeah, I was clipping in the in the hood of the of the cloak, and that was annoying. So I need to get this platform over to this side. The Oh wait, can I? Can I? I can't drag it also when I'm... When I'm here, right? Can I just drag it when I'm on the ground? Can I do th this? Okay, good. I forgot that I, I could do this. I see how the room changes when I move in and out of the archway. Stuff is not back yet, okay. Wish. So now it should be on the other side, right? There you go. Uh, how do I get over there? Can I just go around the corner? There's no corner. Okay. How did I do that on my first playthrough? <laughs> so that's it. When you can move both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. Um, rats. Ah, screw it. I'll never get used to these floors. Yeah, these. So trippy. My favorite move, really. Expelliarmus. 
Did I hit him? Oh no, I didn't. Confirm them. Yeah, it's from the second. <laughs> Repair. Guess that. That is not what I was supposed to do. Okay. Okay, I came from these stairs, right? So I guess I go down here. Oh no, this is this puzzle. <laughs> this is hard, compact. Hello. Akio. Oh god. I used mouse and keyboard with no issue. No issue with what? <gasps> oh, yes, thank you. It's gonna be nasty. I think there's a big fight coming ahead. Hi, Lasika. Hello. One of the infamous puzzles. What is your favorite book? Uh, in general? All books? Ever? Oh dear. Wake and Weld Potion 5? Oh my god, that is very generous. I think I haven't saved a single time today. Hang on. <laughs> Let's do this. Yeah, not, not a single time saved today. Sheesh. Okay, and then also... Oh yeah, never mind. The one that absolutely zero backseating for. I just did it before the backseater could even finish their sentences. <laughs> Hi Patrick, hello. Hey Fun Rain. Don't like the look of this. Did I not even touch him? Oh, there you go. Protego. Expel the arms. things like this like could pick up enemies like this and then throw them at the others are you the last one nice okay hi bell welcome in oh big boy Oh 
shit. Damn it. I had just used my yellow yellow attack power. I want to help. No, uh, this. Good for you. Glaciers. For some reason, he's only using the yellow attack, right? This one. Yeah. <laughs> what a relief. <laughs> what a relief. We did it. Nice. Majin, thank you so much for the resub for, for five months now. Welcome back to the Chonkies. Enjoy the emotes and the after watching. Hello. Hi, Anna Henrietta. Another pensive. Yeah, I'm just looking for a little bit of loot. I see a very nice big chest over here while we were. Plaid shirt and tie school uniform. Hang on a minute. I gotta check that out. That's a downgrade. That's an upgrade. Oh. <laughs> but not visually. Oh no, I can't wear it. What do you mean? Oof. Nasty. Um. Okay. Shawnee, thank you so much for the first time sub on my channel, guys. A first time subscriber. Please, everybody, come forward to welcome Shawnee as a first time subscriber on the channel. Thank you, Shawnee. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. OK. 
here. Wait, there's more. What have I missed? More combat. Hey. Ha. Huh. I have to hover over all the things, huh? Thank you, Shawnee. Talons as well. Uh, I'd do that later. I don't know right now. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. Nice to have you. Figure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The drought was years ago. But the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know, to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Aw, oh, kiddo. Every year a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana. Welcome back to Hogwarts, <laughs> Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood? I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you Thank and the you. others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. Just waiting for the end of the cutscene, guys. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Another memory. Now to find a way out of here. So, we had Squish with three gifted subs. Thank you so much, Squish. Thank you very, very much for the three gifted sub subs. I hope that Hisushi, Mango, and Hopper will enjoy the emos that they just got. Welcome to the Chonkies. And David, my friend, thank you for the 1,500 bits and thus filling the first goal of the day. So we have one song at the end of the stream. Thank you very much, my friend. All crystallized stone. Thank you, thank you. That must be the way back to the map chamber. Hi, Miss Poppins. Hello. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you very much, Squish. <laughs> yeah, it's pets. <laughs> oh. Sheepdog, thanks for the five month resub. Thank you very much. You guys are so kind. Thank you. What have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor Rookwood. 
we saw you in the pensive in Gringotts, with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Thank you, guys. Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter. Of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now, tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's hmm. worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Sure. Uh, before you go... Yes. But first, old sheepdog, thank you so much for the five-month resub. Thanks for all the great streams, Liz. Thank you so much for supporting the streams. I appreciate you a lot, Sheepdog. And welcome back to the Chonkies. And then Anonymous Gifter came forward with five gifted subs. Thank you, Anonymous, for the five. I hope everybody enjoys the emos and the every watching. Thank you very much, everybody. You're so kind. Thank you. Are you going to play Wulong or don't you like Souls? Like, uh, I... I played a few Souls games. I played um, I played uh, Dark Souls three and I played Elden Ring twice. <laughs> Kept Red Beard. Thank you very much for the two thousand bits. Asylum. Oh, Asylum. Thank you very much for the five gifted subs. How are you doing? Good to see you. Hello. Did you just fill the last, the second goal? Guys. That means we have two songs. Amazing! Thank you very much, Asylum. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate you guys. Two songs at the end of the stream. Wah, 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 wah. Thank you. Uh, I decided to check you out after another stream I mentioned. You're absolutely delightful and wonderful streamer for the attention you pay to everyone. I try, I try very much. <laughs> Thank you very much for, for giving me your sub, Shawnee. I appreciate you. Hi, Liz. Hope you and everyone are having a wonderful Friday. Yes, I do. <laughs> How are you doing? Hi, Victory. Hello. Ah, thank you, Squish. Seems peaceful to hear. There's gonna be two songs uh, at the moment. Thank you, Victory, for the 15 bits. So the, the goals that you see in the top of the screen, the, the green and the red bar are full. Um, that means two songs at the end. If the third goal is filled, we have five in total. So, Mr. Charles Rookwood wanted to speak with us. Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank mm -hmm. you, sir. I will look out for them. Where were we were? Oh, we have fall already! Now my hoodie comes in nice, right? <laughs> nice and comfy. 
Dead Hag, thank you for the five... For the five bucks. Thank you so much. Shawnee, thank you for the gifted subs. Thank you very much. The two first gifted, thank you so much. Would you change something of the story of Hogwarts Legacy? Oof. That's a good question. Mm. Maybe the Quidditch part? <laughs> I'm a bit sad that there is no Quidditch. But, I mean, you get broom flying and that is better than nothing for when, it, when you ask me. And if I had to choose between flying only in Quidditch games and then not flying outside of the Quidditch match uh, place, or having it how it is right now, I would rather not have the the Quidditch. I love that I can fly around the entire map and pretty much go everywhere. Apart from Hogsmeade. Drags! Drags! Hi, <laughs> Bear. Thank you very much. Let's go! Drags coming in with the uh, 35, 69 saying, did someone say third song? Actually, third, fourth, and fifth song. Sheesh! Guys, we have five songs at the end of the stream now. Thank you very much. Thank you everybody for contributing to that. Also, level four hype train already. Damn, thank you very much everybody. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, I'm so grateful. Five songs. I hope everybody's gonna be around for later. Hi, Dusky. Hello. Are you gonna go into the dark arts? Yes, I'm gonna go, but so far I haven't even- I didn't even have a chance to learn the dark arts, and I'm gonna keep my- my skills for that then, I guess. Ah, uh, this is also pretty nice. This- mm, I mean, all of them are pretty useful, right? Let's have a look. Stupefy has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. Expelliarmus has the same effect as a curse. So, does that mean it's a curse and it disarms? Dealing damage to a cursed target inflicts damage to all cursed targets. Oh man, this is so overpowered though. What? A cursed effect remains on an enemy for a longer period of time. Pretty good. A restamento has the same effect as a curse. Oh, literally everything that you can use, you can turn into a curse. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's pretty overpowered. Basic cast impacts airborne enemies, contribute more to the ancient meter. Blocking a spell with purple vertigo will send two projectiles back at enemies. Successfully evading. Unblockable attacks with dodge and contributes to the ancient meter. I do that a lot. Enemies struck with stupefy remain stunned for a longer period of time. That's actually handy. Winged world heals you greater effect. This is totally what I need. <laughs> Choice was made. Um, thanks to all the followers, everybody, as well. No idea why they blocked it in Hogsmeade, especially outside in the open. More annoying than anything, yeah. Oh, where are you going, Hartson? What is this music now, please? Uh, you mean the... the music that you hear when somebody subscribes? Aw, oh, Shawnee, thank you. There's one combo that makes you godless. There's a... Strike an enemy curse by crucial releases to protect the curses in nearby enemy. <gasps> Chain reaction. An enemy under your control with Imperial curses other targets with each successful strike. <sighs> Defeating a cursed enemy restores some of your health. Killing an enemy with lava cadaver kills all cursed enemies. <gasps> oh, what? <laughs> so what you do is you go into a group, you use one spell at everybody, specifically if, if it curse with the curses take over, right? And then at the end you just kill one with Avada Kedavra and then kills all cursed enemies. <laughs> so overpowered! Oh my god, that sounds so cool. Um, yep. Okay, interesting. I'm excited to test that out. 
I can't wait to, to test out the, the the fighting with this. Uh, oh my god, I'm so excited now. This is my first chat. Hello. Hi, Said. Relaxing stream. Great. Welcome in. How you doing? Your name reminds me of this one guy from uh, Mass Effect 2, is it? Or 3? Hi, cat girl. Welcome. Hi, Pagode. Welcome in. Curse Plague sounds very overpowered. Yes. Wait, I have literally just these two? Oh god. I could try to get this. I should have. I've got spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha! Stop by the shop when you can. Okay. Revelio. I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. To the ground, okay. So, but first, what do I need? Acquire all three combat plants. Okay, I need to get these two. And I think I couldn't buy it because I was poor as hell. Can I see how much coin I have anywhere? Can you not see where how much coin you have? Huh. Hi Nala, welcome. Uh, Bombarda is a cool spell, but you get it pretty late. Yeah, let's apply a curse to every enemy. Cast one of Cadaver and deletes everything. Sheesh. <laughs> uh, collect troll boogies. Cast a puzzle on a levitated enemy. Sweeping the competition. Purchase a room enhancement. This is so expensive. Oh, we can try this. I'm gonna regret this. <laughs> oh no, that was- we were right there. Um, is it here? Crossed wands. Was it the gear tab for- for the amount of, uh... For the amount of coin you have? Okay. Good night, listen chat. My poor eyes can't hold up any longer. Oh, have a good night, sleep well. Get some shut eye. Oh god. Oh god. My least favorite Hello, thing. Lucan. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Look who's back. Ready to redeem yourself? Ready to get my booty kicked, absolutely. I am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Hi Nat team, hello. Sebastian uh, hello? Controller's like, no, we want Netty. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get started. Gear. Hmm. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Oh, dear. Getting my booty whipped. <laughs> Whooped. Okay, let's see. Accio. Oh, 
No! I'm looking at him! Can bring us defender! I got lucky. I'm just getting started. Okay, we are cocky Slytherin kid, so let's go. That was nothing. I'm just getting started. If the best duelists in the school weren't enough competition, then perhaps you should consider transferring to Durmstrang. Now, to the victor goes the prize! What's the prize? And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. Thank you. It's been an honor. You earned it. You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Yeah. I wonder how <laughs> my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Hey, Eleven, I play on hard. So the hardest difficulty. Um. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Uh, just, just thank you, Bear. Hi, Macaruso. Hey, always this. Hello. First time, easy. <laughs> no. So, okay, that one is done and done. Let's see what else we could do. Collect troll boogies. Hmm. I would like to fight one, but I think that Flipendo is super useful at fighting. Oh man. You know what? Let's let's go up to the room of requirements so we could at least get the the flux weed growing done. Seen a bit, okay, Tamarin. The pumpkins are making me nostalgic for fall. I love fall, it's my favorite season. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so. Titani Mellow Sweet. Mandrake! I don't have Mandrake, goddammit. Uh, Flux Wheat and Chinese Chomping Cabbages. So I need just the. I just need the Venomous. Ven venomous. Mandrake and Venomous Tentacula. That's what we need, right? So let's go to Hogsmeat. To this. Vendor up here, right? Heat that kid with Livioso. <laughs> yeah, the game is super pretty. I think so too. Hi, Adrian. Welcome in. How are you doing? Well, Chinese chunky cabbages. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Oh, I love this in fall so much, but winter as well. And then summer and uh, spring and uh, everything. All, all the seasons are great. All the seasons are great in this. I also love that there were seasons in Sons of the Forest. I think that was very pretty as well. I don't know if you guys checked it out, but you can change the... Um, in the custom difficulty, you can change the length of um, of the seasons. You could even set it to realistic. So you could set the daytime to realistic, so that a day circle in the game is also 24 hours. And then you could send it to um, the seasons also realistic, so you could have like a super duper realistic time. But you could also have just an extended day and then have a realistic uh, season so that it would be like 90 in-game days or so to change season. It's pretty cool. Careful of the mandrakes. I haven't fed them yet. So mandrake and tentacula. Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Oh God, I still don't have enough. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. Uh -huh. I can tell you'll go far. Oh, <gasps> I just have enough. Yes. 
Fuck you. <laughs> Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Yes, that's so cool. Finally, what? Just twelve bucks, right? Just twelve bucks over what I the, the minimum that I needed. Sheesh. Uh, Hogwarts. You can farm a lot of gold finding a chest with the eyes. Yeah, I've I've opened a lot of them in, in Hogsmeade and stuff already, so. Mandrake. So we have Venomous Tentacula, we have Mandrake. Fluxweed and Chinese stomping cabbages. Cool. So this is actually all in the making. 14 minutes, 10 minutes, 9 minutes. Okay. So, do we have anything unidentified? Nope. Nothing to identify. For now, at least. Sag. And Gabriel, welcome in. There's a lot of these chests. Is there one in particular that allows you to farm? I think there is one that is um, broken a little bit, and you could technically. Oh, at least I heard maybe they, they maybe they fixed it. Nope, not this. Here, I wanted to grow more Dittany, or hmm. Yeah, why not? Oh, I don't have Horklump juice anymore. Okay, well. Okie dokie. <laughs> I like that emote, Adrian. So, quests. Let's see. Um, the Helm of the Erd Cot. I'm always thinking of Erd Not. <laughs> Anybody else? Erd Not. The pulso, the three broomsticks. This is what I need, right? Yes. Caretaker, Luna Lament, Gladwin Moon. This one was pretty nice. This is where I le learn a little more, right? Let's go. I have 466 bags of fertilizer, only 433 to go. And then you have... But, uh, is that the maximum? Is that the maximum amount you can hold, or...? <gasps> there was... Wait, there was one of these, um... These cool doors, right? That I look like so much. The math puzzles. Isn't there one? Isn't there one here on the stairs somewhere? Huh. Okay. Your spirit. Haha! There you go. But where's the rest? Revelio. Akio. Walk is dun, 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 dun. Huh. Oh well. <laughs> Not Rags Giga Chat, yours. Revelio. House point hourglasses. Am I tripping or oh glitch? Hey, it's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? No. Let me Thanks for asking first. <laughs> it's like I really like that they're asking first if you have the time instead of just like you know like these these people that 
ring your doorbell and then they want to sell you something and they just keep on talking, 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 Rebellion. talking. And you never have the polite way, like a chance to politely say that you're not interested. You have to, you have to let them finish their sentence and it just takes forever because they literally, they don't even inhale. They just like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> oh man. And I'm glad that in this game, they're taking a breather and hey, ask you first. No, no, nope. nope. Do you have a moment? No, sorry, not now. 1999 is max, yeah. Sus. Oh, here it is. Quali, hello. Have you read? Hey, look at all the lovely Quali bees with the drop stain coming in. How was the stream? Hello. Hi, Sherlock. Hey, Star. Hello, welcome. How are you guys doing? Otari, good to see you. Hi, Tenchi, welcome in. Oh, knickknack. Nice, enjoy. Guys, if you don't know Quality TV, please go check him out. He's currently playing through the Room games. Uh, he really likes lots of... Um, how do I say that? It's like st strategy and puzzle games. So that's what you're going to see there. And also community games when his goals are full. And um, he's soon going to play for the very first time ever the, the Last of Us when it comes to PC on the 28th of March. So... Like, I think after Easter, he wanted to play The Last of Us. I'm so excited. I can't wait to watch. <laughs> hey, Kamana, welcome. How was the stream, Quali? Hello. Oh, man, I'm kind of intrigued to open this door now, but I forgot where where this Rebellion. is. The, the second triangle thingy. I'm too lazy right now. Let's do this. Looking forward to this release. Oh, me too. Oh, there you are. Hello. <laughs> Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. At your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! Uh, um, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Me had, no had nothing better to do just standing there waiting with Mr. Moon. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the Rebellion. form of a demigod. A demigod? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigodes. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. 
It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. Why would I do this? Seems all risk and no reward. Oh, rest assured, there's very little risk and there is, in fact, a reward. I will teach you a particularly useful spell. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Mm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh! <laughs> I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. I bet they loved uh, you. Now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Gotcha. So, Quali, the room three is still not done? Sheesh. He has the best voice actor ever. I think he's a bit, like, a bit much. Is this before or after Harry Potter? Hi, Will Wild Bear. It's uh, before. It's 100 years before the events of Harry Potter. Hi, Fizzle. I'm good. How are you? Uh, hi, Sora. Welcome in. <laughs> Hello, Mora. Also, for some reason I was like. Hello, Mora. <laughs> for some reason I was doing it wrong. There you go. Right, Relafe, it's well nice. Done. You're in. Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area of the castle, after all. Aloha, Mora. Yes, yes. Of course, obviously. Room 3 has crazy much content in the room. It's not appropriate anymore. It should be called the Thousand Rooms. Oh, the, the rooms. Dear Mirabelle. Uh huh, okay. Is there anything else here? Revelio. Bring. Just running into people's bedrooms, stealing their stuff. <laughs> Bye. Ooh. Anything else I could loot here? This took a second. Can I open this? No, level two. Damn it. Bow, 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 bow. Hey, Macro. I love your streams. Thanks for your content. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time that you spend here. Appreciate that a lot. Casting your value reveals authority figures and enemy locations, allowing you to scout ahead and remain undetected. Yes, yes. Elaine, welcome in. Thank you very much. To you too. 
My entire to staff, the Hogwarts House Elves, do an exceptional job of keeping the castle in order. They are seldom unprepared for any number of items that they might encounter each day. However, only the other day, an unexpected stash of wizarding crackers went off from behind a cushion. The cacophony was most untoward, engulfing one poor elf in blue smoke and giving those of us nearby an abominable ring in our ears for the rest of the day. I expect that the culprit was Peeves. Please keep an eye out and be careful, Matilda Weasley. <laughs> Okay, there's no loot. I know that I can come back here and then it's not restricted anymore, so it might be best to do all the exploring another time and just literally go for what is needed. How are your students getting along this year? Rather poorly, I'd say. Is that so? Uh, we're raising a generation of coddled cape flappers that can... Can't open this anyway because I think if I'm not... Taken. That was a tier two lock anyways. Doop, 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 doop. Hi, Friday! It's your day! Oh. Oh man, this part is always so tough. I think. <gasps> Wait, I need to go in here? This must be the prefect's bathroom. There you go. Hi, Fearis. Hello. Hello, Hamora. Oh. <laughs> They were really trying to put as much as low, uh, as many um, Alohomora chests and doors in this little section as possible. I just are they just staring at each other? Please don't see me, please don't see me, please don't see me. Okay, now they leave. I, no! I forgot I that there was one! You will. God damn Ravenclaw, why? <laughs> no! I wasn't paying attention! I forgot that there was one going the other way. Ugh. Why? <laughs> oh man. Do I have to loot everything again? No, the loot is mine, right? Okay, good. I literally, literally forgot about it. I low-key for- hehe, <laughs> low-key. I low-key forgot, forgot about this part. That... That the Ravenclaw is going the other way for some reason. Okay, so the demigeist is done. Okay, so now I just need to... Okay, okay. Bloodfinder, hello, welcome. How are you? Revenue. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other pairs. <sighs> Don't tell on me, okay? Lister Sneaky Malaka. Oof. Hey, Tom, I'm good. How are you doing? Thank you very much for this 27 month resub. Try the emotes when Liz distracts herself with a pun mid co complaint.
up so I'll go. Do I have to go further in to trigger something? It's a majestic sport. Encompasses the whole of the human condition. Sir, how's that? Oh my god. Why second playthrough? Because I, on my first playthrough, I was playing a good character that does not use the curses. And I wanted to do a second playthrough where I use the curses. And that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna do all the, the nasty things and uh, kill everybody with curses. Also, I play now in hard. Just sneak past, sorry, but I tried that before. <laughs> now they decided to move, Jesus, ladies. Can't do, okay. Hey, Tenchi, thanks for the six month reset. You come here. Oh, suddenly dark voice. <gasps> Shit, I didn't I didn't expect her. Oh no, I have to pass through again, right? Come on, come with me. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. La 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 la. Bought myself a series a couple of days ago. What series? I finally get to play it. Really enjoying it so far. Have fun! Hi, Clue. Hello. I love Mirabelle Garlic. I love that Mirabelle. I don't know if you guys know, but in German it's a. Uh, um. Revelio. Mir Mirabelles are a fruit. So she's basically a sweet fruit and then also garlic. <laughs> oh god. Thanks for the follows. Could you please move on? I need to go down there, don't! No, what are you doing? Oh shit. I'm scared. Can I just sneak up on them and. What if they come back? What is wrong with you? Are you coming back up? Or further down? This is very sus. Oh, further down, okay. Got it. Oh, come on, give me a break! came back <gasps> if I would have failed here I would have done the whole thing again hello mr. moon I have the moons you asked me to collect oh goodness <laughs> you're as fearless as I'd hoped an excellent start uh, if we can collect more it may shed some light on who's behind all this 
That's so of course. Close. I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. Maybe. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. If I have the time, but I make no promises. I'll see what I can do, but I'm fairly busy. I can't promise anything. Uh, understood. Uh, but I hope you will find the time. In case it matters, I do have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, hmm. the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Thank you. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. Oh, and I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. And now you can actually go around here, right? <laughs> Which makes absolutely no sense because it's still night. Hello, Hamora. Glad when Moon's voice acting. You do? I think he's a bit annoying. But maybe that's the charm, huh? that he's a that he's a bit bit of a silly goose. Oh, the little rainbow and the golden pot. That's cute. Niffler! <laughs> Nifflers are the best. He makes you think you have to sneak around the castle at night, but no one ever seems to care that you're doing around at night. Yeah, pretty much. Uh... Thirteen, five, and eight. It's thirteen already. Ah, there's the other one. Okay, fourteen. Three and two is five, so nine, which is the whatever this is. This. Slytherin 2. Hey, welcome in. I'm not really Slytherin. I'm just playing as a Slytherin. I'm not really anything, am I? Because this is just a fantasy world, but you know what I mean. Uh, I haven't been sorted into Slytherin. I'm just playing as a Slytherin. This is my second playthrough. I've been playing as a Ravenclaw before. I don't know if there was much else to do up there. So Okay. Let's check what we could do now. Quests. The man behind the moon sweeping the competition. Professor Unai's assignment. This should have been enough time to actually um so we we should have enough time for our plants to grow, right? Maybe we can pick them now. Don't tell Porky's now, Liz. You're a Slytherin heart. <laughs> Hi, Midnight Wolf. Welcome. Looking good. Nice. So, great. Now we can actually use everything. Nothing to identify. Paper said. Ta -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. Okay. Nice. Okay, so we can do the garlic assignment. Ooh. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. So I need to find one fight where I can use all of this these things. And I have another one of these. High chief effects. I'm not really evil, but I'm trying to play as an evil character, which is pretty hard for me because I'm not really enjoying this. <laughs> I mean, I'm enjoying the game and I'm enjoying the playthrough, but I'm not really having any fun and being bad, you know what I mean? 
Hmm. I'm gonna use this a lot, I guess, so let's take this. I did the opposite of Liz. I got sword into Hufflepuff. My first playthrough was Slytherin, Dark Arts, doing main quests and Cello side quest. Second playthrough is as my Hufflepuff is 100% right. Nice. Of course not. Her character in game though. Mm, yeah, my character in the game is a. Mm, mm. It's a different story. Oh wow. Wow, we were. Oh no. Oh come on. Oh, this is better at least. Ooh. Nah, I don't. I don't like the tie. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not okay with the tie. Let's mix it up a little. Damn, on games I love being bad. Yeah, to each their own, right? I'm just... I don't know. I tried a few times to play an evil character when I was playing Fable back in the day and I just never could do it. It's just, like, it just always felt bad. I know I'm just like hurting O's and ones basically, but no. Nope. And Royal, welcome in. Are saying that because you, Liz, don't like being a bad person or because the game doesn't let you truly be a bad person and have the story play out differently? Um, I, do, I don't enjoy being a bad person in real life and also not in video games. <laughs> I'm just not taking... Not, I'm not getting anything out of it, you know? It's like... For me, it's not fun. Sometimes they, the game makes it fun. But usually it's just... <laughs> Painful <laughs> for me. Consti is the worst of us all when it comes to garlic. <laughs> so I need to find a place where I can fight multiple enemies at once, ideally. Maybe a small bandit camp bandit camp. Maybe this. Maybe I can sneak in. Where if my disillusion disillusionment charm and then just toss the toss all the plants in there and let them do the work. <laughs> this should be fun. I would say that I did. Appropriately named. He know the lies and falsehoods. No one's my ear and Rockwoods. Is that you, Roy? What's up? <laughs> Around here can see. Did you transform again? There you go. Okie dokie. So we could finally do that um, assignment. Very good, very nice. <sighs> hey, repulsor rage. Uh, for real though, by the time you learn about a cadaver, you'll be strong enough to kill them with only stupefy. Stupefy! Ugh, dead. I don't think so. 
but we shall see. Okay, back to Hogwarts we go. And then... Level 19? Mm -hmm. Hi, Kulish, welcome. Uh, you will get eventually the broom and then the sky's the limit. I recommend if you really want to have the broom, I, I would really advise to uh, progress the main story to a certain extent and then start exploring because you will bump into areas that you just can't do until you do certain areas. And it's just a bit frustrating for me personally when I have to backtrack. Although this game makes exploration very fun and very entertaining, so it's not too bad with this, but yeah. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful! I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. <laughs> Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome. So here, just, just mind the plants, please. Akio, Confrida, Glaciers. There you go. Done and done. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. Hmm, <laughs> never mind. Apologies, Professor. Perhaps later. Not One question is. I'll be here if you'd like to talk. Okay. One question is Did you ever get the broom upgrades? I never could get further than the first upgrade. Um. You need to explore, Hartson, and then you will get the. Um, you, you will find these um, races. You need to do the races against Imelda, basically. Not actively against her, but you know what I mean. And then um, when you've done that, you go report back to the broom guy, and then he gives you the next upgrade, and then so, f so on and so forth, you know? Don't wake the plants. I did all the races. Have, have you been going back to him? To report to him? You need to go back to him. Uh, what quest could we do next? Troll boogies and cast a pulso on a levitated enemy. Okay. So we need to find an enemy, then we lift him up, and then we smack him down. Need cast him, cast him away, right? World map. Um, I'm looking if I can find a small little area that we can fight in. Small bandit camp? It's relatively close to this, so it shouldn't be too hard, I guess. Oh, oh sorry. All he does is open his shop. Hmm. Might have to progress the story then. Hi, Dugman. Yeah, thanks for the tip. <laughs> Bonk the microphone. Sorry. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. Okay, we need to find a troll as well. Hmm. Stop right! You're the little son that Stop saved right there, criminal scum! <laughs> okay, wait. Uh, levitation and then depulso. Depulso. There you go. Master, expel your armor. <laughs> Um. <laughs> okay, collect troll boogie. Boogie, 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 boogie. Question is, where will I find a troll now? 
Does anybody remember a place for a troll in the in close to Hogwarts? Hmm. Hi Cross, I'm good. How are you doing? Happy Friday. Man, I'm looking forward to my burger. I'm hungry already. There's a Merlin trial that we could try to do. Ow! Triscat, get out of here, Constable. <laughs> you little Tris fanboy. Uh. Revelio. Some mongrels. I want to kill a troll. Hard work day. Oh no, I'm sorry to hear. But do you have the weekend off, Cross? Twice Liz has told me to get out today. <laughs> There's a troll in the Forbidden Forest with poachers. Uh huh. Can you can you roughly point me towards it? I'm not keen on fighting in the forest. But... Jack Doll's tomb... Hmm... Troll in the dungeon! <laughs> Thought you ought to know! <laughs> oh yeah. Part Yen, part Shani. I'll ask Shani. Shani is a true environment's option, which are three. No true, yeah. Get snoo snoo. <laughs> so let's try to find that nasty troll so I can get his boogie, right? Perfect. Target practice. Revelio. Hmm. Hmm. Come on, give me a big troll. Oh, the music is so nice. I love it. You meet your father at the, in the weekend? Nice. Are you having cool plans together? <laughs> You're more, now you have a sword, go deal with that troll. No, I need the I need the the, the, the slimy stuff out of his nose. Rebellion. The troll that is not Pega. <laughs> Dear poachers, have you perchance uh, seen a troll around here in this area? That'd be mightily helpful. Allow me to put you out of your what? Last time I was in Lower Oxfield, my sack was full. Oh man! I think the troll was in the clearing near the unicorn site. I don't remember where that is. I was watching Wednesday eat hot wings yesterday. What? <laughs> the dens are on the map, but only if you found them. And I haven't found any because I just started the game and I haven't touched anything really. Is this just spider? This stupid bandit cams. I need I need a troll layer. <laughs> Buying is the easy way out. Yeah, true, but it's also boring. I want to fight. Oh, hello! <laughs> I want to fight a troll now. Man, I got my favorite combo spells now to, to fight a troll. Now I want to do it, and now there's no goddamn trolls. This is stupid. Any mountain symbol? 
Mount what is a mountain symbol? <laughs> Any mountain symbol? I, I I fear I don't understand what a mountain symbol is. This this moment in the song sounds so much like Elder Scrolls. I know what a mountain looks like, but I don't see the symbols for it. I just see this, which is a, a bandit camp. I, I don't see any. <laughs> maybe I'm maybe I'm looking for the wrong thing. <sighs> there was one south. Self that I had unlocked, or self that you know of? This one? Mongrel layer. This is not mountains, is it? But is this the... Is this the thing that you meant? Mountain? <laughs> Use the Marauders map. This, if you look out your window, that's what a mountain looks like. <laughs> Ah, oh, you guys. Oh man. Ugh. Okay, I know what I gotta do. I gotta travel around off stream and unlock all the fast travel points and then try to revalue the the crap out of this map. Okay, I don't know. We will continue this tomorrow. I was hoping that if Rebellion. I if I would go like like through this and would revalue all the time that the big trolls would be pointed out easily. But I just see mongrels and little humans and this is not helpful right now. Yeah, all humans. Who says crime doesn't pay? But Yeah, and fear is also not what I need right now. Sedge. I know there's some further down in the south by beaches and stuff, but... Wait, what level is this? see that guy. Can I open you? No, of course not. <laughs> Why should I? This looks intriguing. It's like a place right out of a storybook. <laughs> okay, let's save here. Save. This was a triumph. Hi, Daryl. Making a note here, your success. We will just continue here tomorrow, same time to, as today. 